I know, I'm a professional streamer again. Can you believe it? I'm actually doing my job in this economy? Wow, who would have thought? Definitely not me. How's everybody doing? Oh, wrong one, there we go. How's everybody today? It is currently about to storm. It has been very, very, very rainy in Toronto these last few days, and honestly, I am here for it. Please ignore how messy my office is right now. I have not had the time to take care of it. I will probably do some office cleaning tomorrow before I prep for Fan Expo. But you know. Hi, Brandon. Hello, Godforsaken Soul Saints. Or Scout, rather, nice to see you again. Let my friends know about advance. I can't drink any drinks. They can hospitalize me. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, you don't drink that, but your friends should. And they should use my code for a discount. Are you streaming and not running dungeons all day? Mm, I do kind of want to run some dungeons, though. Let's be real. Should we also do the Dark Knight quest? I can finally do number 68, or quest level 68. Hi Ray! Just playing Final Fantasy XIV while watching you play Final Fantasy XIV? Hell yeah! Final Fantasy XIV uh, Inception. We'd love to see it. But I'm good, Bree. How's your evening going apart from playing Final Fantasy XIV? Mikey, thank you so much for the three month reset. I appreciate it. Thank you. And Melon, how are you? I'm having a shit day. Excited to watch the stream. Oh, hi, Arcady. I'm so sorry you're having a shit day. Well, I hope that my stream can uh, make you feel better. So I have something to tell you guys. My breathing has not been good lately, and I'm sure you guys can tell when I'm reading dialogue in the game. I have to take like deep breaths every so often, and I have to... <laughs> and I don't know if it's like long-term COVID or what, but I have been very exhausted. Like my lungs have just been, you know, tired. So um, I'm gonna try to take it easy when it comes to cutscenes. Hopefully they don't, they don't like, you know, overexhaust me too much. Hi Delta Juliet! Consecutive streams? Do I even know you? I know, right? Me? Streaming? Doing my job? Unheard of. Yeah, I am trying to take it easy. I'm doing my best. I need to get a new inhaler. Mine is expiring soon, and I'm not looking forward to trying to get that. But I gotta do what I gotta do. Hi, dentist. Hello. I had to drop my son, my son off at the airport, then I got a flat time on the way home. No! No, first you have to say goodbye to your boy, and now a flat tire? Oh man, that must have been a bitch to deal with. The flat tire, not your son. <laughs> Thank you, I hope I get better soon too. I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. I need to just cut out caffeine from my diet, like, officially. Like, 100%. But I love caffeine so much, so do you see my dilemma? <laughs> I love caffeine, but it does not love me in return. Hi, Elise! How are you? Having the garbage right beside my stream is so nice. I don't need to, like, run around to throw things out. It's pretty great. Alright. Caffeine is life, but it is killing me. It is absolutely killing me. Yeah, I've tried cutting caffeine multiple times, and I always come crawling back. Thank you, Jose. How are you? Okay, okie dokie dokie. So, how does this sound as our plan for the day? Hold on. This is what I'm thinking. We'll start the stream off with the Dark Knight quest, and then we'll dive into Stormblood. Huh? Huh? Hi, Grandma! Grandma, how are you? Hello, Slim Grim. Mm. It messes up my BP as well, and just every other aspect of me. My lungs, my BP, my head. I also have a sinus headache right now, so that's not fun. Hey, Calm Knight, how are you? I know, I love every single drink that has caffeine in it, but they don't love me. It's a toxic relationship. Melon, thanks for drinking grandma and stuff. I appreciate it. I'm down to one or two sodas a day, and I think that it's as low as I can physically go. You can do better than that. I know it. I believe in you. I believe in you. It's an addiction. It's a real addiction. 
All right, let me bring over our alerts so I can refresh them. Unfortunately, the two subs we got are not going to count for the daily subs, but that is fine. Anism, hello, how are you? <laughs> no more Kirby's. No more Kirby's. Well, I mean, at least there are pop cats in the chat. Pop cats are always good. Okay. So, my husband and I are here, as always, chilling, doing whatever it is that husbands and wives do. Oh, Furbies! Oh no, honey, the Furby is here. And also behind me. Where is he? Yeah, there's the other one. Oh, my husband is also sitting right here. Chillin'. <laughs> Angel on my left side, devil on my right side. Oh my god. That's funny. So I said my left side, but this is my right side. But for you, this is my left side. So you know what? That's still a dub in my eyes. How are you so goddamn beautiful? How are you so goddamn beautiful? I'm not sure. Magic, I think. <gasps> it's a feline to hug and kiss. Wait, Mark, look, 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 look. See, look, we match. Wait, 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 wait. Come back. See, look, we match. I told you. But mine's better because it's it's got the pearl white dye. So it's like pretty, you know? Yeah. Thank you for gifting a community some cosmos and welcome to come for Benjamin's in your stay. Oh my god. Man, if we do the Dark Knight quest line, I'm gonna have to talk though. I'm so winded. You're a natural beauty? Thank you. Yeah, directions are very difficult. Hi Dalif, hello, hi Romegalo! I know the husbandos are already here. They're always here. Thank you for the hydration and dentist. Thank you for the five community subs. I appreciate it. Can I dye my sleeves? No, you cannot. Only the black part of your outfit is dyeable. Thank you. We go for this evening to make it to Gadania. I believe in you. You got this. Thank you, Brandon. Take care. Have a good night. Every time I see your character, she gets cooler. Oh my god. Just you wait. Hold on. Look how cute. Wait, look how look how cute she is in this armor. My baby is so cool. She's so she's so cute. Look at her. Look at her. I don't have any like super like interesting armor or like glamours rather, but you know, we do what we can with what we've got. I'm slowly on my way to leveling to you know, levels that allow me to wear cooler armor. So eventually, I will not look like an army. <laughs> Hi, Frozen Ape. Hi, Liz. <sighs> Just paid my car loan, so far she can only afford five subs. That is okay, dentist. The fact that you even wanted to give subs is amazing. Thank you. Okay. Oh, oh! You have a little axolotl. Oh, I pet. Oh, he's gone. I wanted a pet. Now I just pat the air. Oh, I like your little cow thing. The buffalo. Very cute. <laughs> okay, yeah. So we're gonna do the MS... Oh my god, I'm so winded, chat. I need my inhaler. Sorry, I'll be right back. I need to use my inhaler. I know it's gonna expire in like a month and I don't want to use it because of that, but I need my inhaler. I'll be right back.
chat, give me one second. Give me one second. my inhaler I'm okay hopefully that helps I need to cut out caffeine and onions and I fucking love onions so that's not gonna be easy god my hair is a disaster CJ thank you so much for the 29 months I really appreciate it welcome back BB oh. feeling better um I think so not me almost taking a nap without simping, but Queen, how's the stream been? Good, I think. I can't breathe right now, so, um, that sucks. Everything was fine up until now. Why onions? So, onions, I don't remember what it is that's in them, but they affect, like, this part of you, like your, like your lungs and stuff, or at least for me. If I have too many onions, I, I can't breathe. <laughs> I don't know if it's like a sensitivity. It's not garlic? Oh, yeah. Okay. Alright, let's do the MSQ. I really wanna... I really wanna grind dungeons though, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Kind of being the world's baddest baddie is asthma. Yep, I got tummy problems and asthma. I can't win. I'm just dying. I'm not allergic to onions. I just can't have like a bunch of them. I'm just very, very sensitive. Thanks for the hydration, Slim Grim. What level in MSQ are you? I got no clue. It's literally the first like Stormblood dungeon, or not dungeon, but the first Stormblood quest. So. 60? 61? Should I do the MSQ as a summoner or as a dark knight? Yes, bad digestion gang! MSQ means less talking. Yeah, less talking and the same thing if I do dungeons, also less talking. Girl, you failed this weekend? Stop! I know, I'm so sexy. All the sexy people have issues. Every single one of them. We all got problems. It is what it is. I can't breathe. I shit all the time. I puke all the time. I have trouble sleeping. What more do you want? Dark Knight's like it's Empire. Samurai? I don't want to do samurai. I mean, I guess that's like fitting <laughs> with the with the thing because it's like I know like um like each sorry with each um expansion there's like a canon class, right? I know for Stormblood it's like samurai and monk, I think, and then for uh, Shadowbringers, it's Dark Knight and something else, I think. I don't know what it was for Heaven's Ward. I thought it would have been Dark Knight. That seemed fitting, but like, I guess not. Girl with the IVS got the best whom whom. You right, my whom whom be bussin'. 
A dragoon, right, yes, dragoon, dragoon. Bard, really, bard? Bard, warrior, dragoon, monk, samurai, dark knight, paladin, interesting. Can't confirm I'm very hot, and I got that kinds of issues. You're literally only fine with the frail inbred families in Europe, but literally, I'm struggling over here like a small Victorian child. Honestly? I really want to level up my Dragoon. I think it's only like 45. Yeah, it's just 45. It's very small. Um, I think I really, I really want to do Dark Knight. I like, I'm like maining Dark Knight now. It's a lot of fun. Hello. Hello. Oh, what you giving me? What am I getting? Oh, you're giving me coffee. Right after I said I can't have coffee anymore? Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Bean. <laughs> this bitch. This bitch laughing at my pain. Fuck you. You know what? At least in game, I can drink coffee. <laughs> at least in game, I can drink my coffee. <laughs> yeah, I know Samurai starts at 50, but I don't want to play Samurai. I don't want to. I'll level it at some point, but I don't want to use it for the MSQ. I'm sure it's fun, but... <gasps> Krile! Okay. And that's Lise. Okay, so... What else is here, though? That's my delivery moogle. Gatekeep. Lucin? Lucine? <laughs> Lee's nuts. <laughs> I even came in a Starbucks uniform, or did you? Oh my god, you did! I... Okay. Okay. So, wait, no. I mean, okay, mm, uh, <coughs> Chat, do you want spoilers for one of my upcoming photo shoots? Hi, Pars, how are you? So, see this, um, this outfit CJ's wearing? I, I, I may have purchased it in green. <laughs> so, I may be able to do a, a cat girl, um, <laughs> chocobo bucks, uh, photo shoot. Anyone want to get their milkies from me? Kitty girl needs some milkies. Yeah, I'm stoked. <laughs> it's already here. I just have to find the spoons to um, shoot it. I'll probably do peppermint or maybe ishtola. I don't know. I'm so excited. The milkies. All right. Hi, Lise. Lise is eager to leave Castrum Orions. As you've probably heard, there are plenty of factions in the resistance. So I'm taking us to, the, to see the one with the most influence. The headquarters are located in a place called Ralgar's Reach, an old temple to the east of here, across the Vel Veladina River. I learned a route that should allow us to avoid Imperial patrols. Stick with me and we'll be there before you know it. Alright. Well, it's a good thing you disappeared. Hey, Vince! I won't be able to handle that. Good. Uh, those are some big fucking bears. Um, we ball. We ball. We ball. Oh yeah, I forgot. I I rebound some of my some of my abilities. Vince, I'm still running on a high from our uh, our adventures in the uh, library yesterday. The werebears! Thank you, Comrade. I hope I feel better too. Welcome back, Hermit Viking! How was the cottage? Oh shit, hold on. Hi, Fabio! Little Sasso, my pointy ear fetish? Hell yeah. Wait, that even applies to cat girls? Why are some of my abilities locked? Oh, 
Oh yeah. I'm, I dropped a 64. No, but I should be able to use these, but now I can. This is a little easier than I anticipated. Thank you for the hydration. Thank you. I'll drink my water just after this. Elves and cat girls, they are the best. I do love me some elves and I do love me some cat girls. What can I say? Oh, CJ's helping me, that's why. You know, the post is up to about music change. I love how it's different for expression. Yes, I did notice that. I did. I shouldn't say anything. I was too enthralled with killing these grizzly bears. I do like that each expansion has its own flair. It is really nice. It spices it up, you know? Nice. We did it. Thank you, CJ. All right, let's go. No, tree bear, leave me alone. Literally a like literally an end. This is literally an end. God damn, they're flexible. How did you not break? You can hardly bear the suspense. You get banned. Sarajasan, how are you? How are you? Hello. Uh, we had a little spot up by Sellable. I don't know where that is. It's like something some random wipeout on the stairs. Oh no, wipeout on the stairs. Wait, what happened? What the fuck? I'm doing good, how are you? I'm all right. So we just got to Stormblood in uh, Final Fantasy XIV, which is the second expansion. And it is heavily like East Asian based, like themed. It is fucking gorgeous. Look at this. Oh my God, the trees. Wow, it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so, so, so pretty. All right, we're starting the first quest for it. So we're finally dipping our toes in. Hi, Cassette, how are you? Hello. Still with me? Good. From here, we'll head northeast towards the river. The water's not too deep, so we won't have to swim. All right, girl. So you want me walking in water? Ew. Ew. CJ, are you just gonna come and hang with me? Are you just gonna come and, <laughs> and kill things with me? Is that what's going on here? Oh, she do a clap. <laughs> Toes, Osara's a pro. She knows how to work the algorithm. Toes? Toes? Wait, what are we, why are we talking about toes? Who said toes? Oh, you're in the level for this? Oh, that checks out then. So north, oh, part of Lake Huron. Okay, as with the wipeout, the sorcerer went from the rain and had a lot of uh, forward momentum. Oh no, are you okay? That fucking blows. Actually, a South Asian inspired zone and walker. I'm supposed to go there soon. I've been told! Sarnix showed me some of it. I'm very excited to see that for myself. I can't wait. I rarely get to see South Asia uh, represented in video games. So knowing that that's on its way in my playthrough in this game that I love is like really exciting. It makes me really happy. <laughs> I will probably cry, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, I did say dip our toes in. Yes, yes, I know what the people want. Please be voice acted. I can't read. I don't think it is. I don't see any soldiers. Good, let's cross. You're wondering about the tower to the south? I wasn't, but now I am. Ominous. The red light means they are evil! It's part of the Castellum Velodina. That's what the Imperials decided to call the old bridge after they for, uh, fortified it. I call it a great big eyesore. Honestly, you can see that rotten banner from about absolute moms away. <sighs> they never miss a chance to rub our noses in it, do they? Come on, we should keep moving. Literally Britney Spears. <laughs> Literally.
You're vibing out? Good. I just have a forearm sized bruise on the old buttocks now. Oh no. Battle scar, dude. Empire Angie. Empire take over. Empire said nothing for you. This looks like a. Oh, it looks like the tip of a dick. I just saw this on my mini map and I was like, oh, that is a cock. That is a circumcised penis. If I've ever seen one. Hi, Raya, what's up? The cock map. Cock map confirmed. Come on. No? Not gonna let me up there? Cool, it's a good thing I can't fly here. Right? Oh. I can't, but I can jump. Ew, those fucking spiders are hideous. All right, rub it in, why don't you, CJ? Rub it in. <sighs> Hopefully I can stream long. I really want to play, but my lungs just are not happy with me. I might need another puff of my inhaler. All the best maps are penis shaped. I don't know if there were any cock shaped maps in Heaven's Ward. Or maybe there was one, but it got destroyed and speared in the vault. Would have really liked to navigate that map. Oh well, beggars can't be choosers. What is that? Oh, it's just someone TPing. We're here. On the other side of this pass is Ralgar's Reach. So you say, but all I see are rocks. I presume there is some sort of trick to this? Indeed. A glamour. What? Good eye, Ishtola. I take it they have a talented mage in their ranks? Or mayhap an artificer trained in the modification of glamour prisms? Something like that. The important thing is that it fools the Garleans. Or Garleans, I guess. Is it Garleans or Garleans? Because I say Garleans, but it's probably Garleans. Whatever. I've heard it a thousand times in cutscenes, but I'm, you know. Oh, before we go in, I don't know if Tataru told you, but my friend Nago, the messenger who came to the Rising Stones, is a member of this faction. I'm gonna turn on the heat because I think uh, I'm too cold and I think that's like not helping. Take some deep breaths. I'm trying. I did meet Lise. Yes, we met her in the last stream or the last two streams or something. Two streams ago, I think. Okay. Give me a second, y'all. Give me a second. I was perfectly fine. And then I went live. Yeah, I'm gonna be right back, chat. I need to just go stretch or something. My, I can't breathe, so hold on.
Okay, so I stretched. And that felt good. Now... Now I am putting on some Vicks, and I think that's going to make a tremendous difference. I took another puff of my inhaler as well. Amen, Elise. I agree. I agree. They killed it. They absolutely killed it with the with this game. I am feeling a bit better, dentist. Thank you for asking. I'm gonna take an Advil. Hopefully that'll help too. Because I am getting a bit of a pressure headache from the thunderstorm. So I'm hoping this will help. All right. Yeah, it could also just be the storm that's like affecting my head too, which is not or my head, uh, my breathing too, which is not surprising. My body is like incredibly sensitive. So, you know, the slightest change in the air pressure and temperature will have me fucked up. Hi, Vosk. All right, do we need the light on? Can we have a cozy stream? <laughs> Is this okay, chat? Don't mind me, by the way, if you see me just casually huffing my Vicks, it helps. Yeah, it's pretty stormy here. Waldo is terrified. I volunteered to read for you. I appreciate that. I would actually love it if someone could read for me. Like, if one of my mods, like, had free time or, like, a buddy, I don't know, that'd be great. Yeah, poor Waldo. He's okay, though. When we were on our walk, he was, like, really enjoying it. It was nice and cool. We were out for a while. And then Thunder literally shook the ground. Like, I could feel it in my bones. And Waldo was like, Oof. And he started pulling me home. <laughs> it's stormy, my bad. Yeah, how could you do this, Anna? Have to collectively VA every no voice cutscene? Yes, absolutely. And you have to take turns with characters. <laughs> Thank you, Vince. Literally, he's like, all right, bye, 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 bye. No more of this, mommy. Okay. Uh, Grandma, do you play Final Fantasy XIV? And would you ever be interested in playing Final Fantasy XIV? Because if you would ever like to play, I will play with you. So, I'm just getting it out there before I dive back into the story. All right. I'm kind of interested. Mama. Grandmama. <laughs> One of us. Can we get some covenant emotes in the chat? One of us. Do it. Join our legion. Join our coven. Oh my god, wait. You could literally... You could literally join our FC and be part of the coven. Come hither. Come hither, babes. Come hither. Alright, so they know us, and they shouldn't attack us on sight. That said, they could be a bit jumpy, so let me lead the way, and uh, don't go reaching for your weapons or anything. Oh. Sounds good. Yes! One of us! One of us! <laughs> and with a sprinkle of demasking dust, all is laid bare. Oh shit. Oh. Oh! Oh, lit! And now we're going to the area, Ralgar's Reach. Damn, that's kind of cool. See, Grandma, this could be you. You okay, babes? No, not really, but I will be. Breathing is really rough today. Oh, please tell me this one is voiced. Uh... I remember the old stories. 
How the Breaker of Worlds came down from on high and cleft the earth with a single blow. Ooh. Ralga's Reach, a holy place and a fitting home for the resistance, for the brave God, and the true, me. the loyal sons and daughters of Alamigo. They were waiting for us there, men and women whose souls still cried out for what was lost, for what could be ours again. Oh, isn't that Nago? She's okay. And she's already back and somehow ahead of us. All right. I guess etherites, right? Are there many female mods or was CJ literally be doing every female character? No, we have a fair like 50-50. Welcome to Rolgar's reach around. Don't fucking kill me, Ray. I'm slowly convincing my partner to play, even bought the fat Moogle mount. Oh hell yeah. Romance ain't dead. You'll forgive us our precautions, but we couldn't be sure who had crossed the barrier. We see you now for who you are, though. The Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Yeah! Conrad knows the purpose of your visit and would like to give you a proper welcome. Now, I know you would not have come all this way unless you had something important to discuss, and I'm eager to hear what it is you have to say. But let's not do this on our doorstep, eh? Come with me. First of all, Devin is voicing Ishtola! Don't! Fucking kill me, Undoing Uriange. Sarnex increases that himbo count by a lot. You're absolutely right. You are absolutely right. Sarnex is our residential himbo alongside uh, Caleb. Ew. Oh, okay, cool. Oh. Oh, my controller disconnected for a second, but we're all good. Exchange for what? Resistance tokens? Raksha tokens? Let me attune to this while I can. Oh, there's a big etherite. I didn't even see it. Can I even attune to that? It's kind of out of the way. Yeah, I should be able to. Oh, my headset. That sounded weird. I hope he's like, so he sees my bullying. I fucking hope so too. Caleb as Caleb as Estinian? Oh my god. Who's Orshafon? Caleb as Orshafon. Caleb would make a good Orshafon. Oh my god, or Drew. Oh my god. Alright. This place is really pretty. It reminds me of that one area in um, Dragon Age Inquisition that pretty much everybody but me, I guess, hates. <laughs> Uh, where all the shards are. It has that vibe. So when do- when does materia get beneficial? Because I remember everyone telling me to just sell my materia. And so I have been. But I don't know if I should have listened or not. <laughs> Hissing waste too, yeah. Who am I voicing? Ray, who are you voicing? You're Tataru. An elf, you know. That place is hell? Yeah, it is kind of rough, but it's one of my faves. But I have no taste. Mostly for rating? Okay. Dips on Moogle voices? Um, I'm the Moogle, come on. Even though I can't breathe and I can't speak, I have to be the Moogs. Do you think Tatara has a smoker voice? <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh my god. sell materia on the market god damn materia dealing <laughs> i'm the mulican yeah as big as him height wise you're like six six materia is mostly an end game thing so you can stock it stuff randomly if you have it but otherwise not needed all right sounds good lolifel is probably also on like golem let's be real 
What is my... <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> what is my husband doing here? Did I attune to this already? I don't think I did. Thank you, dentist. Take care. Bye-bye. Laws into freaky shit, we all know it. Oh god. I don't want to have this conversation. Sick. There were only two, and then the big one. Okay. Hi, husband. Were you just sitting here waiting for me? You're just waiting this whole time? Yeah? Who is this bunny boy? Stay away from my man, weekender boy. Back up! Back the fuck up! Get out! Get lost! That's mine! Move! Get out of here! Scram! Allow me to welcome you once more to Raga's Reach, our humble headquarters. Go forth. My name is Conrad Kemp, and I have the dubious honor of overseeing operations here. It is a pleasure to meet you, Master Kemp. I am Alfino Leveilleur of the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, as are my comrades. Before I speak of our purpose here, pray allow me to thank you for sheltering Ida, forgive me, Lise, and Papalimo at great risk to yourselves. No, no, there's no need for that. They risk their necks for us enough times. It was the least we could do. It's kind of a gilf. I I wanted to, um, I mean, about the mask and... Ah, oh, don't fret over that. You're not the first person to take up arms against the Empire under a false name. We'd do the same if we had any sense. My condolences for your lost child. Papalimo laid down his life to save us to give us a chance to make a better future for ourselves. There will never be a better time to drive the Garleans from our lands. Girl, close but your we mouth have to take the lead on this. We can't leave it to fanatics like Ilbert. Pepper looks so much like More than a few of our people now? were taken in by his promises. Followed him all the way to the wall. Good men and women who never came back. When Monago told us what had happened, how the bastard had made sacrifices of them for his twisted ritual. By Rolger, it filled me with an unholy fury. But what's done is done. Best we can do now is see that it wasn't all in vain. That is why we are here today, sir. To see that some good comes of this tragedy. On behalf of the Eorzean Alliance, we do hereby I extend a formal Alfino's offer of military outfit. assistance it's to the really Alamegan nice. resistance. Do you now? I would love it in Pearl White. Well, go on then. I'm sure there's more to it than that. That's so nice. So that's the way of it, eh? The Alliance, hoping to avoid a direct confrontation with the superior forces of the Empire, wishes to engage them by proxy with our vastly inferior ones. That's the TLDR, My comrades yes. and I must confer on your proposal. A moment, if you please. Of course, Master Kemp. Take all the time you require. Oh, that was it? Okay, interesting. So what have you decided on? Alfino is pondering how best to make use of your leisure. Oh. Ooh, it's better than what I have on right now, so that's a dub. Dope. The hilariously short time. I think it's cute. So it seems we find ourselves with a surf. Is it surf? Surfit? Surfate? Surfite? Free time. 
Ah, uh, forgive me. You are free to look around Ralgar's Reach. In fact, I would encourage you to do so. It'll give you a better grasp of our current circumstances. No! Thank you, Master Camp. I believe we'll do just that. No! Let us make the most of this opportunity and assess their assistance capabilities. No! Free to poke our noses wherever so we will, eh? I like the sound of that. No! Well, I already know this place inside out. Can I show you around if you like Pepper? Or I can show you around if you like Pepper. Sure. Great, let's get started. Why did she like start off at a run and then just literally move two feet? <gasps> That's really cute. Weekender boy offers a moment of silence. Oh, because of Orshifa. Oh, sweet boy. Sweet, sweet, sweet boy. I'll bet you think the resistance is mostly made up of Alamegan Highlanders like me. But the truth is that we don't even account for half. We've got Hellsguard from all the way over by the spine in here. And plenty of secrets of the sun like Nago. There's even some beastmen. Well, beast women, I suppose. Like that one over there. She's an Ananta. They've been with us for a while now. Well, one of the smaller factions has. The rest won't have anything to do with us. We're no different from the Garleans to them. They keep to themselves, spending all their time crafting. And not to make the most amazing jewelry, by the way. They use magics to twist metals and crystal into shapes you won't believe. It's a pity people hardly ever get to see their work. But then most don't even know they exist. That's enough about them anyway. Let's take a closer look at the statue of Ralgar, shall we? Who is she talking about? The Ananta? What's a... Oh... This? God damn! God fucking da- I am looking? It's like a snake lady thing. Alright. My people. <laughs> I see. Alright. So we're going over here. Let me just make this smaller. Just by a little bit. There we go. <laughs> I'm not a scaly, but you know, I think I might be now. I mean, I already, I always have been. It is a Thailander. Not impressed. <laughs> Her name is Liz. I can't wait for you to get to one of the trials in this expansion. I think you'll love it. I'm excited to see what you're talking about. Hi, Loop Guru. I'm gonna kick back and lurk while I enjoy. While I watch, enjoy. Bye, Carbonated Viking. Thank you for lurking. I think they're somewhat South Asian inspired. Yeah, they look very Middle Eastern inspired. Middle Eastern and South Asian inspired for sure. Pretty awe inspiring, isn't? The Breaker of Worlds, who guide our ancestors to these lands all those centuries ago. Ida used to tell me the story on Stormy Nights. She wanted me to understand, to remember. At the end of the fifth astral era, when the waters rose high and higher, people. All across Eorzea beseeched the heavens for a sign, and lo, a burning star appeared in the eastern sky and led the way to these mountains in Gir Abanya. They who were saved by his grace pledged to honor and revere him, to devote themselves to great works without and within. A storm of blood aha, approaches fast, hells open, heavens weep, for no one soul doth lie beneath or lie beyond the measure of his reach. The last part was since Redmond was done by a monk of the first of the fist of Ralgar. Ida explained it to me. A day with com a day will come bringing strife and sorrow that none may escape. Waste not these precious hours, but in quiet preparation make strong the body and mind. Okay, foreshadowing. A storm of blood, perhaps? I don't know if that storm of blood is finally upon us, but if it is, I have to believe that everything we've been through, everything that has led us to this point, will see us through in the end. Ah, sorry, that was all a bit melodramatic, wasn't it? Let's keep moving, shall we? Off to the infirmary. The infirmary? That's gonna be fucking depressing. This way. I know they said the thing! They said the thing. Oh. What is that? What is that? 
What are you riding? Interesting. All right. I guess it's in here. There's no way this character's name is Deafening Glare. This is the barber. You'll find countless injured fighters here either undergoing treatment or awaiting it. Tread softly should you go inside. Oh. See, back home, this is not what we consider to be a barber shop. Oh, wow. Look at all these tinctures and potions and whatnot. We need to make an incision here, here, and here. Oh, he's dead. Oh, homeboy's dead. He's got bandages over his eyes? Yeah, just put him out of his misery. Here, I'll help you with that. There you go. Barren hard? Yeah, me fucking too. Alright. This is the infirmary, as you can probably tell. Here's where the resistant healers patch up the wounded and tend to the sick. No matter how carefully we planned our operations, casualties were inevitable. It's a sad thing to think about, but it's also important to remember the cost, as Conrad would say. We should go. I'll show you the Etherite Plaza next. Girl, I already went there. But thank you. Thank you for the tour. Oh, I'm so sorry. Causing mayhem. Collecting dust. Ah! Bring me the tongs literally the size of a Lala so that I can pull the splinter out, yo say less. I thought you'd be used to row names by now. No. No, absolutely not. I am not used to any of the names in this game. They still shock me and confuse me. And I still have trouble um, uh, saying some of them. Even if I hear someone's name in game, I will fail to pronounce it over and over and over and over and over again. I'm not very good at this. Wait, why did I run here when I could have just teleported? What am I doing? <laughs> you seem like you're finally feeling better? Yeah, a little bit. Just a little bit. When you've seen one etherite, you've seen them all, right? Not quite. This one's an older design, dating back decades to when the fist of Ralgar was still here. I was gonna say, I feel like it looks different. It may look a little different, but it works just as well as any other. I'll show you where the Salters are. The Sutlers are next, but don't forget to attune the etherite before we go. Is that why you're taking me to all these places so I can attune, girl? <laughs> all right. Okay. And we're met up with Alize and Alfino. Arms, armor, potions, you name it, these folks got it. The resistance would be in a bad way without brave merchants to keep it provisioned. If you're short on anything, or you need something repaired, these are the people to speak to. Oh! Alfino and Alize are here. Why don't we see how they're getting on? So you mean to just turn around? Sure, babes. Alize is nodding approvingly at the sutlers. Alright. Come to take the measure of our friendly neighborhood merchants? Yes. They're a bold lot, that much is plain. If the Imperials found out they were peddling their wares to the resistance, there would they would be lucky to escape with their lives. It's a gamble I and I admire their courage, but their motives could hardly be said to be altruistic. Ah, here you are. I've been looking all over for you. Oh. We finished discussing your proposal and we're ready to receive you all back at the tent. I've sent someone to fetch each Woo! I've sent someone to fetch Ishtola and Creel and Kryl. So if you'd like to follow me. Sounds good. Wait, aren't these my people? Because I have those cat eyes too. Aren't I one of the Sun Mikote? I am a Sun Miko, right? What if I just. What if I just. What if I just. You know. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's not weird at all. No, this is just a normal day in uh, Pepper's life. Nothing new to see here. What the fuck was that? Oh, it was the little goo boo. Oh my god, that scared me. I was like, whose fucking ass is in my face? 
Pepper inside, pepper font, just another evening. Yeah, usually it's the other way around, but you know, it's okay. We don't mind a switch. <laughs> oh, I should be wearing my cat ears. I'm so sorry, chat. I gotta wear my pepper ears because we're doing the MSQ. I gotta put back on my earring. Thank you all for no, waiting. Don't, actually, that's fine. We have reached a consensus. Why does he sound so sad? Is he gonna say no? Yeah. I, Conrad Kemp, do oh. hereby accept the Aeorsian Alliance's proposal. You must understand, however, that our cooperation comes with certain caveats. Those caveats being... I take no joy in this, just so you know. Were it within my power, I'd offer you more assistance. What is he talking but about? But the resistance is far more fragmented than you realize. The men and women in my care belong to but one of many factions. Simply put, I can only speak for the people of Rolga's Reach. That's a start? Now. I have every intention of appealing to the others, and I expect many will agree. But it will take time, and I cannot guarantee universal support. Oh my god, do not tell me I'm gonna have to do side quests and shit to gain Understood. their approval. Understood. I shall see that the Alliance is under no misapprehensions as to your position. Much obliged. But that's not the whole of it. As you can imagine, the loss of those who cast their lot with the Griffin left us short on numbers. Some of our most trusted veterans died at the wall, and we've had to fill their posts with the young and inexperienced. Oh no. Frankly, everything's in a right bloody mess. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. Oh, we'd be more than happy to help you get back on your feet. If we're going to work together, we'll be doing ourselves a favor. Well, there's no shortage of work to be done, that's for sure. We're in dire need of new blood, too. Now that's where we come in. Ishtola and I could lend a hand in the infirmary. From what I saw, they could do with a few more healers. Very well. I, for I my part, shall return to the Rising Stones. With, um, I'm certain Ishtola there are others among the Scions who would welcome eyes. the opportunity to fight for Alamegan liberation. Um... Is there anything else we can do to help? Okay. I have something else in mind for Random you, Random stretch. Monago and Mephrid will tell gaze. you more. Understood. We won't let you down. Okay, speak with Alize. Where is she? Where is she? There you are. Right then, Monago and Mefred are to be our keepers. That's that's how you pronounce it, right? I think that's what he said. Knowing not of what they require, one task is as good as the other. Make your choice, Pepper. Let's see, what do we have here? Um, nothing that I think is gonna be good on my classes, but I will get one nonetheless! Your ether compass may now be used to locate. Oh, yeah, ether currents. Right. Um, oh, yeah. It's no better, but that's fine. Couldn't put on Astro, I think. Alright, back to Dark Knight. Oh, I literally just have to pick one. Uh. Do I just pick one, or. Or. Do I have to do, end up doing... Well, will I end up doing both? Well, I know who Nago is, but I want to speak to Mefford. I want to see what he's about. Mefford cannot help but wonder if you remember who he is. <laughs> what? Well? I mean, I am kind of under the assumption that I'm going to have to end up doing either of these. One gets me a bunch of experience, and the other one gets me experience and items. Okay, yeah, so I'm definitely going to have to do both. 
At the risk of repeating myself, it's still hard for me to believe that we met we'd meet again here, of all places. Though I reckon you probably don't remember me after all this time, eh? Of course I remember you. Ah, uh, well, you see. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't think I recall who you are. No, no, it was a lifetime ago. There's no need to apologize. But know that down in Quarry Mill, we didn't forget about you, nor the lives you saved. As for me, I went to Little Alamigo when Galleon was recovering. Gundebald was my former com commander and an old friend, and I had a lot on my mind. In the end, I decided to disband our unit. I told the men to live their lives as they saw fit. Some just remained in Little Alamigo, and others went to Uldah for work. But as you can see, I chose to come back to Girabanya and join Conrad and the others. I've kept busy since then, ferrying people and provisions across the border and back. It's not been easy, and it's been, but it's been fulfilling. Today, however, we'll be heading east into the peaks. Conrad thinks we, Conrad thinks we might have luck finding new recruits in the village of Alagana. How could you forget Mefford? I know. I'm so sorry. How could I do this? How could I ever do this? Alagana, if you're going there, you're taking me with you. Ah, oh, that's right. You're from Alagana, aren't you, Elise? By all means, we'd love, we'd welcome the company. There'll be more to it than just asking around, but we can talk about it on the way. Make your preparations and meet me by the tunnel to the peaks. Alrighty. Oh, and I guess I'll just accept this one right now while I can. Before we begin, I'd like to thank you and the Scions again for patching me up after I bled all over your floor. I owe you my life, and I won't forget that. Furthermore, it was rude of me to run off without saying a word. It's all well and good me claiming my duties here couldn't wait, but a parting thank you was the very least you deserved. My apologies. My apologies, as some would say. And thank you. Now to business. Commander Campson trusted me with a formal reply to be hand-delivered to the Alliance leadership. It covers everything we discussed, as well as detailing the disposition of our forces. What I need is an escort, one or two men at most, so we can make it to the wall swiftly and without attracting undue attention. Very well, I shall join you in this. General Alden commands the forces as at Castrum Oriens. It should be simple enough to see it into his hands. Great! That's just what I wanted to hear. When you're ready to depart, meet me at the pass leading out of the reach. Okay! So yeah, I've got to do both. I knew it. I knew I'd be doing a little fetch quests. And two. All right. Are you planning? Are you playing on PC using a controller? Or playing on PS5? Yeah. Thank you, Melon. It's PC with the PS4 controller. Um, I don't know which switch. So we'll do this one. Oh, this is Mefred. Okay. Well, at least we're going in order then. Alright, let's see what this is all about. This tunnel will take us all the way to the peaks. We're on a mission for Conrad to Alagana. Clear the barricade if you would. Aye, sir. Shouldn't take more than a moment. Oh, I love his hair. There are more villages there than out here, but also more Imperials keeping a close eye on things. We'll need to tread carefully. Alrighty. Sounds good, babe. Sounds good. Okay. Ooh. Ooh! It's so pretty! Come on, Middle East. What's going on here? I remember the peaks of Girabania, silent watchmen that would stand long after we were gone. Was that a belly dance? No, I don't know what we it was. We came seeking allies to join us in the fight against the Empire. People who like had had enough. Flowers. People who had suffered every possible indignity, who had been treated like animals, day after day after day.
Oh, the glamours. Yes. So cool. Why are we like slow mo walking? That little dance? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. You're gonna love Endwalker. The inspo here is subtle. I am looking. I will immediately forget, so we ball. We have a glamour in place here too, as you may have noticed. So far as Imperials are concerned, this is not more than a testament to the savage impulses of a lesser race. Ooh. Remember though, once we leave these ruins, we'll have no glamours to conceal us. The villages to the east keep watch for patrols as we move. Sounds good. Okay, there's an etherite somewhere, right? I saw it in the cutscenes. It's, oh god, I'm not gonna be able to- Oh, it's over here. So it's just past where we're going. Ooh, Girabanyan Hornbill. Let's go kill it. Let's go kill it. I love the subtle differences in the battle music. It's like, it sounds familiar, but it is obviously different. I love that. Neat. Neato. Let me eat some food while I'm here. Let's have the steak. Okay. I'm gonna ride on my chocobo. I mean my mount! My mount! It does not count! It's not a real chocobo. It's not the same. This is the one that my boy gave me, okay? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, that was easy. Let's see. What does he have to say? Narian Imperial in sight. That's a mercy. Alagana's due east. Past that bridge. Follow me. It's not much further. Ooh, okay, so they're gonna just take me to the area with the etherite. Yeah, okay, perfect. Ethical and regal, exactly. Exactly. What the fuck? Your mount is beautiful. It's very Elden Ringy. Yeah, we're. Oh, that is a fucking huge butterfly. Holy shit. And I will kill it. Flutterini. Like, flutterini. Like, flutter. That's hilarious. Not entirely clever, but. Alright. If you have to guess what country I think uh, it's based off of. Well, immediately the name reminded me of, um, <laughs> of Albania. I don't know. I don't know. A part of me immediately jumped to, like, Singapore. Um, but I, I am not sure. I'm getting, like, Middle East, but also, like, Southeast Asian atmosphere and like inspiration. It's very pretty. It's very like North African meets like South Southeast Asian. Oy. But also I'm getting Arizona vibes, so there is also that. <laughs> Yeah, we are anti chocobo. Sorry, babes. I'm gonna sleep a bit. Good night, everyone. Have fun. Bye, Dallop. Take care. I miss Heaven Ford. What's sad? That we're anti chocobo? How is that sad? It's like Persian. My people? Literally my people? Yeah. Yeah. I can see it. I can see Tehran inspo. For sure. For sure. Reminds me of Afghanistan? Yes! Yes, actually! 
You can rest easy. We made it. This is Alagana. It feels strange coming home like this. I always imagined it would be... Oh, sorry. This has nothing to do with why we're here. We need recruits. Aye, we do, but as I said back at the Reach, it's a little more complicated than just asking for volunteers these days. As you know, we've sh we're shorthanded because many of our people were taken in by the Griffin's promises and went to the Wall, never to return. It wasn't just them, though. Folks from all over, including some of my former comrades, answered his call to arms. As for why we came to this particular village, it's rumored that Alagana lost a few use as well. If there's truth to that, then there could be others sympathetic to the cause. Then again, after the Griffin's betrayal, they may be suspicious of outsiders claiming allegiance to the resistance, and rightfully so. So with all that in mind, how are we supposed to convince them to join? I mean, I knew it wouldn't be as simple as giving a speech in the village square. None of you didn't want the place to be burned to the ground, no. You might as well piss in the, vic in the viceroy's eye. We'll need to be a good... We'll need to be a good deal more circumspect? Circumspect? Than that. You never know when an Imperial spy is listening. We must speak with the Elder first. I know for a fact he can be trusted. We'll listen to what he has to say and decide what to do after. Okay. Sounds good. Closer to the Banyas than your other guesses? Hmm. Hmm. That's fitting! Giving the name! Oh, the Banyas, the Banyas, the Banyas. <laughs> Alright. It's very Turkish, too. Okay, so the main quest is somewhere here. Oh, still outside. Are you fucking serious? Okay. Alright. Ragafrid. Ragenfred, the village leader, is over by the shore. No time like the present. Let's have a word. All right. Big brain Syra? What? Because I said it reminds me of Turkey? I feel like I have this on PlayStation. You probably do. Oh shit. Final Fantasy XIV is an old ass fucking game. <laughs> what isn't it on, honestly? I want to get a Steam Deck just so I can play this game in bed. I would never leave my bed. I would play all night. It would be a disaster. Turkey's a direct insult for this region? Oh, hell yeah. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Okay. I have fixed my face. It's not on the switch yet. True. Yet. Keyword. <laughs> Don't know you, traveler. You merchant. You'll not buy. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings and well met, elder. And sincere apologies that I did not send word ahead of our arrival. Too long I've been away from Alagana, and I would, and I wouldn't know of your recent troubles. Ah, your comrades of Mefred. I see. I see. Speak on, though I suspect I know your purpose. The griffin came with many men, and left with many more. Such is the rumor. Is it true? He lit a fire in their hearts and then dangled a dream before their tired eyes. And now you come to seal away what few remain. Oof. The griffin was a traitor and a madman, and we had no part in his schemes. We have made an agreement with the Alliance, and this time it will be different. This time? This time? Cold comfort to the dead and the ones they left behind. How much more must we give before you've had your fill? But, but surely you hate the Empire as much as we do. They took our lands, our traditions, even our god, and they demand a fifth of what little we've got left. I, I hate the bastards with every fiber of my being. But hate's not enough, Mefred. I can't, we can't keep doing this. I'll not tell anyone you came, but you need to go. Now, leave us be and never return. Damn, be like that. You've got no right to speak to us like that. Why did I just pull out an accent? I've got a quarry that was producing barely enough to keep us fed, and that was before half our young men and women went off to die for your bloody cause. So yes, I've got every right to tell you to leave my village. God damn. Hi, Faith. No, you don't. Because it's my village too. My home. What in the hells are you on about? Wait. I know those eyes. You're one of Curtis's girls. Lise, 
Lise Hext. What a name. And I'm here. I'm here to take back my homeland. Alright, Thor and Oakenshield, relax. By Ralgar, the last time I saw you, you were... I didn't even know if you were still alive. And I never thought you would come. I almost didn't. And my sister never will. Lots of others won't either. And that's why we've got to carry on the fight. You even sound like him. As you say, I've got no right to tell you to leave. Alagana, as much as your home as it is mine. But I say to you again, we can give no more. Yes, I heard you the first time. Let's go. Damn. Hi, Red Man! She got sass. Wait, I attuned to this, right? Did I? I did. Okay, cool, 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 cool. My bad. Alright, there they are. That could have been handled better, but what's done is done. At least we've been granted uh, permission to stay. I was hoping Ragenfred, Ragget, Ragenfred, Ragonfred, Ragged, whatever, might help us to recruit some of his people, but that clearly isn't going to happen. If we're to convince any of them to join, we'll first need to regain their trust. Oh, it's risky and it's hardly subtle, but I say we approach the villagers directly, see what problems they've got, and see and if we can do anything to help. Makes sense to me. Let's split up and ask around. No, no, no! These are the worst types of quests. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, can I go back to Heaven's Ward now? Can I just do all the side quests there? <laughs> Poetry is a big part of the Persian culture from what I heard. Yeah. Looking for folks down there. Look, congratulations, you found one. As you can see, my leg ain't what it used to be. Some days I can hardly walk off the pain. Mornings are the worst, especially after cold nights. Hard labors right out. Too much pain and trouble for others. There's a tea. What helps with it, though? I uh, need to grind a chapuli horn and a hornbill talon for the blend. Don't fucking make me go kill those. Oh, I'm volunteering? You're a lucky pepper's nice. Because I, however, am not. All right, question chat. Do I need to read any of these or can I just go through them? Hi, dissatisfied. Because I know I'm just doing fetch quests, but like my breathing is still funky. Shut and get to kill him. Are you all loud? All right, cool, 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 cool. So they're trying to invite me to a taco FC. Um, That's cool and all, but that ain't the coven of mints. So, do you really want to be there? Come on, girl. Fuck him up. The music is quite good, I will say. Isn't Chapuli a food? In that quest of visit Gadania, right meow? Hell yeah! What you do know I could have just... I could have just gone to um, Limsa or wherever it was you were. I just realized you didn't actually have to do all that. Yeah, Papa Limo died. Papa Limo died, um, like obscuring whatever the fuck it was. I don't even remember. Um, but he used that gift that Minfilia gave us to like obscure, oh the primal. The primal that they were trying to summon. Who wasn't that was trying to summon it again? The, the Empire? Shinryu, yes. It's a dragon. Papa Ligma. No! Not Papa Ligma. Not Papa Ligma. I like to work for your attention. Oh, I like how you think. <laughs> Ilbert was playing with his balls. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. They gave Ilbert, uh, who was the griffin. Was Wait, was Ilbert the griffin? Yes, Ilbert was the griffin. And they gave him the eyes of Nidhogg. Because when Alfino and I threw them off the abyss, we, th we thought that would solve our problems. Uh, no, absolutely not. People could just go down and grab them. Anyways, that's exactly what they did. And, uh, yeah, and then he absorbed them, uh, jumped off the, like, the platform, like, this, like, the, um, 
not ceiling, the rooftop, and uh, turn into a fucking dragon that they call Shinryu. Sloppy. <laughs> Sloppy. I hated it. I hated that. Disciple of these nuts, don't kill me. Don't fucking kill me. All right, all right, and I gotta go down here. Speak with frightened co- is it coral? I still know how to pronounce that. Like those like leopard creatures. Coral? And Grim and Enid? Speak with frightened coral and Grim and, and Grim and Enid? Okay. Wherever the hell that is. Man, and I'm gonna have to do side quests just so I can fly here. Can you believe that? The audacity of this game? Making me work? Making me do quests? In this economy? No, I don't think so. At least I can level up my Dark Knight. Let's kill two. Two for the price of one. Do you ever play WoW and you can be Pathfinder? I have never played WoW and I don't think I will play WoW. So the reason why I avoided games like Final Fantasy XIV and WoW is because I knew I would get obsessed with them, spend a lot of money on them, and never like see the light of day again. And um, yeah, now look at what's happened to me with Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> Make sure you're using your Aether Compass, but I don't wanna. That's my problem. I'm stubborn. Yeah, we don't have the audacity command anymore. I flip through ether current quest so fast so I can fly anywhere they let you know and then they keep adding places I can't fly. Pain. Pain. Oh, you're a row. I thought that was good. you were going to be an animal. Pick up the unconscious 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 unco pick up the heavy sacks I'm really good at pronouncing words I know you would not believe that English was my first language so wow Pathfinder is like you have to do like a month of grind to fly in the x pack no fucking way a month I would never play. And like, don't get me wrong. I am into like RP walking. I do like to explore areas on foot, but not when they're like excessively large and I'm doing a bunch of fetch, fetch quests, you know? All right. He wishes he could join us, but he can't. Alright, I got the TLDR of that. Yes, I got you your goods. Here you go. I never meant to. I mean, in terms of these, you think never think people will actually. Blah, 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 blah. This was no reason not to tell you that my father got soul was deathly sick. Do, 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 do. They marked me as a rebel, or so they said. Oh no, she got attacked! Aww, that's sad. Sucks to suck. Alright. 
Oh, no! I'm so sorry! I didn't mean to do that. I was already running. I was already sprinting. Here we are, Pepper. I've been trying to help the villagers deal with this food shortage of theirs. Recently, the Imperials have been swooping into villages on the nouns and seizing supplies in order to prevent the people from stockpiling. Aw, in case they might be in league with the resistance. So much, but I've taught them a few tricks that better hide what little they've got left. How's Lee's getting on, by the way? You'd think people would be more inclined to just a little girl, assuming they remember that it is. I don't know how it's going. I will ask her. Ah, she's speaking with a cynical youth. Let's see how this goes. No, I didn't mean to. And where were you these past 20 years? Where were you when we were being ground under the Black Wolf's boot? On the other side of his bastard wall, living the high life, I'll wager. Oh, fuck. That's not fair. Oh, and who's this? Another one of your freedom-loving friends dating to help us poor unfortunate souls? Trying to whip us into a frenzy so we'll go and storm a castrum with our pickaxes and shovels? Leave, all of you, before you bring a cohort down on us all. And you, don't you dare speak like you're one of us. You can't even begin to understand what we've been through. You weren't here, Elise. You weren't here. This is my home, and I love it with all my heart. And if you truly have any love for it too, you'll keep us out of your doomed rebellion. Damn. He has a point. No matter what I say or do, it doesn't change the fact that I left them behind. This isn't about me or anyone else. It's about Alamigo. Let's go and find Mefred. That was something. And I won't lie. I'm kind of not into her whole, oh, but this isn't about me. This isn't about me. This isn't about me. Like, okay, well then stop making it about you. Focus on the on the real problem at hand, babes. Come on. I don't even know what the real problem at hand is, babes, but still, focus. Focus so I can focus so I can remember, please. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, Caleb! Looks like the Elder wasn't the only one unwilling to hear us out. Can't blame them, given what happened to the wall. I thought I might be able to appeal to them as a fellow. I don't know. But if anything, it just made them angrier. I haven't lived through it like they have. I can't claim to know the struggle like they do either, at least. I ran too, hi. But if I hadn't, I'd have never met Pepper or the rest of you. We might not be here today in a position to make a difference. So I don't regret my choices, nor will I apologize for them. There's more than one way to fight. True. And you should not be ashamed. Oh, who dis? Help! Someone, anyone! We need help! Oh, perfect! And this is exactly what's gonna make everyone fall in love with us, right? Come on. Ooh, let's go take care of this mess. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, the drama music is playing. We're Carta. Work, 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 Carta. He, who, who. The Tributum and the Bloody Ramen. Ratman. Not the Ramen. Dar, thank you so much for the two month reason. I appreciate it. Eventually, I have to start Final Fantasy XIV. Yes, you'll have to join us. Join us! You there, take a deep breath and then tell us what happened. It was all business as usual. The tributums do soon, or tributums do soon. We were taken to the Imperials when the. God, I forgot about the Keykern? The Keykern? Attacked! They took my brother and our money! Took him where? Ruins to the south of here. It was just an old temple where they came and. Listen, Ricardo's only family I've got left. If I lose him, I... The ziggurat? If the rat man took him there, he's as good as dead. We've got to get after them. We have got to get after them. Oh, I, thought, I really thought she was going to say we've got to go after them, but okay. If there's even a chance of us still alive, we have to try. Do we? Do we? Oh, is he going to join us? Oh, he's having second thoughts. Oh, he's feeling bad. Oh, He's like, damn, I shouldn't have yelled at her. You're right, Lise, we've got to help them. If not for the missing man, then for the Tributum. The Garleans won't suffer excuses if they're late. Yes. I guess that's what we're doing now. What else would we do? I think I just heard Molda fart. I love that for me. So our crowd is being held somewhere at the Ziggurat in the, to the south. Which has been taken over by a host of, of Kykern bandits. Kykern. Kykern? Chikerns? Chikerns? Kykerns? What about covers it then? We prepared for a fight? They may not be the most challenging foes, but there's sure to be a lot of them. 
It's a good thing I have AoE abilities. Alrighty, so we're going this way. Okay. The QQ. The QQ! The QQs! What the fuck is this? A dust anilla? Oh, I love him. Oh, I love him. Oh, you make me so happy. I have not known happiness until I've seen you. You have changed my life. Until my eyes met yours, that's when I knew God was real. Incredible. Whatever the fuck you are, I actually love you. I just agree with a couple fingers, literally. So this area is very pretty. I am really into the purple flowers everywhere. Definitely my aesthetic. Well, the flowers are my aesthetic. The rest isn't, but... I mean, I guess it kind of technically is kind of my people, but... <laughs> okay, Byron's beard. Nice. Oh, look. It's another beardy fella. Checks out. That's Byron. Did you see that? Did anyone else see that red wing thing? Oh, there it is. I thought my eye was playing tricks on me, but I guess not. I kind of want to go kill it. It's huge. It's a blood glider. Fuck it, we ball. Oh, shit. Sure. So what did the letters beside the enemies mean? This one has a K beside its name. Why? What does that entail? I've never understood it, and I see it in dungeons and stuff too, but I don't understand what, what it, like... What it means. It's a way to identify enemies, but... But what... Oh, hi, Kelsey! But like... But still, what does it mean? What does the K stand for? Oh, so like attack K, attack... Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Like tags. Okay. Please let me go. I'm begging you. I don't want to die. Oh, are they going to drop him? Is this a killy situation? Oh no, he's just up there. I think he's on top of the ziggurat. <laughs> They're so cute. <sighs> Alright. Trying to fuck him up. Let's go, babes. Uh, do I just kill all of them? I mean, I guess. Oh, no. I guess it's these ones. Wow, I'm really glad um, my party is being really helpful. Really glad I'm the only one fighting here. What? I'm so glad they're doing things. Wow, you guys did so much. Please said there'd be no challenge. Bitch, shut the fuck up. You just stood there. I don't want to hear it. Yeah. 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 Hi, Lucas. I am cool. I am too cool. They just don't want to step on my thunder. I understand. At <laughs> least staring at the mobs really hard. I'm helping. Fucking useless. <laughs> oh, 
is that a current? That is a current. Oh shit, oh my god, who is that? I don't know who that is. That is not an NPC. Oh, and now they're dusting. Very cool. Very cool. This is fun. I am having a blast. I am enjoying this. Still be chocobo and slaver, although Chocobo has a cute hat, I like it. You know, at least he's taking good care of his chocobo. Oh, is he helping me? Oh, he's helping me. Oh. <laughs> I clap. I clap. Thank you. Oh. What oh, they give me they give me jacket. They give me bottoms. They give me shoes. <laughs> they give me snow white dye and rose pink dye. Oh, I give them, I give them one gill. Fashion police, ma'am, here to help. Fashion police? Are you saying I'm fucking ugly? Or is that for the fashion report? Wait, are you gone? Are they just leaving? Oh, this guy literally came to me, said, your f your clothes are hideous. This fit? Nah. Whack. And then left. Literally in my chat. Do you see this? Fashion police, ma'am. Here to help. And then literally drove off into the distance. He said I had no drip. Gave me clothes and then dipped. Understandable. Have a nice day, sir. <laughs> I love my fit. Well, now I'm insecure. <laughs> okay. Hey, boss. What's good? What's good? When did you get here, buddy? I love playing hide and seek with boss. Okay, this may be overkill, but ask me if I give a fuck. Yeah, I didn't get all of them, but that's fine. Because some of them ran back. Oh, still mommy, I have to eat my food. going on here? What is this? What is that? Do you give a fuck? Do I? Good night, face. Take care. Try them? Try the outfit? Why? They were mean to me. They said I was ugly. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Amazing. All right. Did they give me gloves and they gave me bottoms. And then they gave me dye. Did they give me shoes? Oh, they did. What did they give me again? They gave me... They gave me... They gave me... They gave me this, this, something else, and die, right? Love your cat ears. Thank you, Lilac Cr Crouton. I like your uh, username. Thank you. No, I'll keep it. I guess. I wanted to buy the varsity jacket on the market at one point, but I didn't. You can check chat. 
varsity jacket. Oh, and the tarot skin shoes. Tarot skin shoes. Cool. Um, I have never looked more queer in my entire life, but you know what? That's okay, because I am queer. The pants are cute. Pepper would never wear this though. Yeah, they gave me pink dye and I think white dye. Yeah, rose pink dye and I think snow white dye. <laughs> is this what they wanted? Is this is this what they wanted? They them pepper. Are these the vibes? With the gloves too? Was meant to be insult? Oh no! The person is watching my stream! I was kidding! I was trying to be funny! It's okay! It's fine! I'm not upset! It's called content! It's okay! Thank you for the fit! You're now a bully though! You are canonically a bully! In Pepper's world! In my world you're not, but in Pepper's world you're a bully! <laughs> Where are they? Where'd you go? Where is this person? No! No, I have no armor! And now I'm in combat! Oh no, my chill, I love it. Wait, oh my, no chill, I love it. Oh, wait, is it you? Cosmos, was that you? Are you the slam fire? Is it you? Were you the fire of slam? Is that you? <laughs> I get head pats. No, I wasn't, I swear. Oh, it's not you? Oh. Well, you about to go buy a Subaru? <laughs> Real have to do it to them vibes? Yeah, literally. Mm -hmm. You nod? Oh, it is you then. Is it you? Is it you? <laughs> it's you! Hi, Chowderhead! Chowderhead, thank you for the, for the goods. How dare you bully Pepper though? How dare you? How dare you tell Pepper that her fit is hideous and then fly off into the sunset? The audacity. You're lucky I'm not reporting you to the police. Have a good day. Enjoy your account while you can. Yoshi P will ban you eventually. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I want those weapons, they're pretty. Who's theirs? I didn't really get to look at them, but they were a dancer, that's all I knew. Oh shit, my bad. Oh god, oh crikey, oh I was not paying attention. Okay, we're ball, we ball, we ball. She is like, what happened to it, literally. <laughs> but don't worry, I'm not mad. I just thought it was funny. You're fine. Pepper will never forget this. Ah! 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 Oh. Oh look, they're not dead. By Ralgar, what did I ever do to deserve this? I've gone to bed hungry for months. Oh, I'm skin and bones. I hardly make a snack, much less a meal. Oh. Well, thank you, Elise, for doing so much. You're here to rescue me? I am. You just sent us. It's gonna be all right. My sister. Oh, Ralgar, be praised. She's safe. And you, you lot fought for your way in here just for me? To think there are still good, brave folk in this world. It wasn't that difficult. I got bullied, but I mean, it had nothing to do with the people that like, you know, kidnapped you. If I don't make it in time, there's no telling what will happen to me and my sister. Wait, what? Yeah, you can't run after him, let him do his thing. I'm glad we saved him, but seeing him run off like that, got a bad feeling about this. I think we all do. But it's time to go speak with Minago. 
Lisa's never been one to ignore her conscience. Oh, never mind. Oh, who's that? Oh, are they hot? Listen, Pepper, Mefred, I think we need to go after Workarda. Wait, you had better not be thinking of stopping him. You heard what he said. If we don't, if they don't pay one way, they'll pay another. Are you f I hey yo, I'm in the middle of a cutscene, bro. Are they just crafting in the back? <laughs> Please, now that's a whole meal. Is she a whole meal though? Is she? Is she though? All right, Lise. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I know that, I do, and I don't want to interfere. I just, I just want to see that he makes it there safely. If that's the sum of it, then fine. Let's head down and see if we can't pick up his trail. Okay, can I just like jump off the edge here? Oh my god, can I? No! Oh! That was a big fucking fall. Okay, nobody attack me. Nobody can attack me for like 20 seconds. Ooh, is that poop? No, oh, no, that is a bag. It is a soiled sack, so it may as well be poop. Upon closer inspection, you find nothing of interest. So poop. Lisa's thighs themselves are a three-course meal. Down bad. Down bad, please get him. Get him. I found him. Flower! Oh, I dodged it. Fuck you. <laughs> Suck my ass. You can't kill me today, baby. Thanks for the water if you're thirsty. Yeah, can we get some um, hydration in the chat for Anna specifically? I think she may need it. And me too, Loki. But not for Lise. All right. Let's see. <laughs> Anna sipping that water. She do a sippy sip. Fuck off. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. So it wasn't over there, so maybe it's this way? Oh, I'm like even further away than I was before. Okay. Huh, this is fun. I love this game. Love running around in circles. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, let's go back over here now. Let's see. I don't see anything else sparkling. Oh, I'm still far away. Go figure. My character is female, but not me. My bad. I'm so sorry. I meant they them. I'm so sorry. They're down bad. They're drinking that slurp juice. They're drinking their water. Can't be thirsty for Lise. I'm probably like her older sister's age. That's fair. How old even is Lise? Like, canonically? Is she supposed to be? Honestly, it fucks me up because, like, I don't have um, the Twitch gender uh, pronoun extension on. Streamlabs OBS. I feel like I should just go on Twitch and like have the thing pop out. That way I can see everybody's pronouns if they have it. That'd be a good idea. Hi, Salamane! Chrono Google 25. Oh, Lisa's as old as me. Sick. Very sick. We're the same age. Yeah, and I'm 41. Yeah, so no simping. Any luck? Legally, it's okay. Morally, it's not. A chocobo feather, is it? I by my reckoning. It came from Wakrata's bird, in which case... There's a clasp bridge just around the bend. Hug the rocks and stick to the shadows. We'll find them soon enough. You're only 25? I am. Have I ordered a McDonald's meal? No, I have not gotten McDonald's. No. 
I'm cutting back. Even though I literally just had some last night, I'm cutting back. <laughs> Her voice actor looks quite similar though and she's mid thirties. Interesting. Interesting, I don't think that makes it any better. <laughs> Any minute now, I expect he'll come thundering around the bend and hear that? Get it covered quickly now. All right, I'm getting under cover. Chocobos are so cute, I want one. <gasps> Who is this? Are they Imperials? Voice acting. Worse, skulls. Listen, Lise. Whatever happens, stay hidden and do not intervene. Understood? Oh, she ain't gonna listen. What? <laughs> what? You there! Halt! You know you shouldn't be here. Explain yourself. Oh. I hope nothing happens to this guy. Forgive me, sir. I, I came to deliver the tributum. Oh, I. A likely story. Only a fool would dare to come so late. Or, mayhap, a resistant spy. No! No, you've got it all wrong! I, I was waylaid by bandits! I it's not my fault! Oh no... I'm nervous, I said HALT! <laughs> that was a heavy punch. Where'd he drop, though? Gold? Is this a joke? You don't seriously expect us to believe this is a fifth? How stupid do you think we are? It is, I swear, on my mother's life. Oh no. Oh no. Spare us. You came late, you lied about bandits, and then you tried to cheat the Empire of its due. Think you can kill them all, including the ones watching from the tower? Even if you did, others would come for him and his family. You'd be condemning them all to a life of hard labor, assuming they didn't just execute them, that is. But it isn't fair. I hate this. It's your bloody fault we're stuck out here patrolling this God's forsaken wasteland. It's your fault I have to listen to people go on and on about how Alan Egan's can't be trusted. I've worked and coiled harder than any man. I'm a citizen, God's damn it. And what are you? A stupid, stubborn little dog who'd sooner bite the hand that feeds him and pine for the good old days. I hate this. That's enough! Lord Xenos is expecting our report. Lord Xenos? Why do I know that name? Do his punch at the inside of his cheeks while he talks! <laughs> Don't kill me. I Why bet does the Pepper look bastard so happy? can't believe his luck. He gets to go home. We should do the same. Can she smell us? She knew we were there. Why doesn't he just ride his chocobo? It's right there. Your transportation. Let me adjust my lighting. So I want like a little bit of light. Oh, I think that's okay. Just like the low light. Oh yeah, that's good. All right. I'd heard their commander was keen eyed, but gods, that was a near thing. It tears me up inside to see our own kinsmen doing the bidding of the Viceroy, but they made their choice, and if it comes to it, I'll cut down every last one of them myself. Hell yeah. Oh, you know what I want to do? 
that I just like completely forgot about. I want to um I want to do the reaper quest. I forgot. Would you all want me to do job quests on stream? Or would you rather me do them offline? I can level the jobs offline, but then do the quests on stream. I already did like a good chunk of the Astrologian ones offline, unfortunately. Do the spooky slice? I want to, I want to. Online is good. A lot of job quests are nice. Yeah, you guys would like to watch a job quest? Okay. I'm so sorry that I went through Astro. There's obviously still more to go, but... You know. Missed the beginning parts. I forgot her... I forgot her name, but... Fella the purple girl for the Astro quest line is hot as hell. Especially dark quests are sick. They are! I have one to do right now, and... <laughs> And I really, 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 really want to do it. Ooh, I have a rested experience boost. So maybe once I wrap up a few more of these um, main quest lines, I will do the Dark Knight quests again. We were doing them last night, I believe, and I tried leveling to level 68, but I couldn't get it in time. Um, but I did it today. Now we're at level 69, and then eventually I'll be at level 70, so I can do two there. Dog quests don't get really good till Shadowbringers. That's okay. I still think they're fun. They're still fun for me, babes. 69, nice. I know, right? <laughs> you can just stand in the middle of Gridania and judge other people in town as to go on a watch. Oh, stop it. That's very sweet to you. We owe you a debt of gratitude for what you did. Where Krata told me everything. How you fought with the Kikern and saved his life. For all the good it did. We saw what happened when he met with the Skulls. How they beat him after death. We could have stopped them. I, I reckon you could. Mefred's a warrior, as is your comrade. And you're strong, like your father. That much is plain. But I think, but I thank Ralgar you did not. Because it would not have ended with them. Where Krata and his sister would have been branded insurgents. If not the whole lot of us. Bones heal, scars fade, but the dead remain dead. We're alive, and that's more than can be said for only the gods know how many others. That's enough for you, is it? To put up with whatever they do to you, so long as you get to see another day? Yes? <laughs> that's right. You grit your teeth and you learn to live with the pain. That's really fucking sad, t uh, to be honest. I'm going quick to judge you, Lise, and for that I apologize. I know you and yours mean well. I do, but I'm telling you, gods in the heavens is my witness that we've got nothing left to give. We can't help you. I understand. Thank you for your honesty. Uh, that's so sad. She may say it, but she doesn't mean it. Nor would I expect her to. Her father was as stubborn as an ox, too. If she said I'm walking the same path, I but pray she won't follow it to the same end. Oh, not the foreshadowing! Is she gonna die? Nah, no, 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 no. Well, she could better than I anticipated. Which isn't saying much, I suppose. We should go and see if she's alright. Do we need to? Do I need to go see if she's all right? Is that necessary? Donde es con Mia? Where is she? There she is. Anyway, so I get to the next answer press. Uh, I'm at level 68 right now. What is the, uh, what is the next one? Is it level 70? Sorry about running off like that. Ella Megan's terrorizing their own. I just can't accept it, you know? No matter what he thinks, they shouldn't have to put up with it. Day after day after day. I'm not completely naive, you know. I didn't expect him to storm a castrum with their pickaxes and, uh, sorry. With their pickaxes and shovels, or whatever it was. But nor did I expect Rokrata to just lie there in the dirt while they kicked him. I can't claim to know their pain. I can barely remember this place or, or even my father's face. But I remember Ida's. I remember how scared she was when we ran. And that look in her eyes when she talked about home. Her home, but not mine, is it? Oh. There you are, Elise. I've been looking all over for you. Oh, it's this guy. Is he gonna apologize? 
Well, you found me. Got something else to say? Aye, that I do. I, um... I said some things to you before that I shouldn't have. It wasn't my place to do so, and I'm sorry. All that rubbish I spouted about how I love my village. But when one of ours was in need, I was cowering here with all the others. I didn't even think to go after Wakrata, but you did. Made me feel like, like the bloody hypocrite I am. If I, only, if I truly cared for my people, I'd fight for them. So I will, if you'll have me. Oh, We got someone! When you put it like that, I suppose I am. That's not just me. Oh, but not just me. There are others I know who've been thinking about it for a while now. There's not many of us, and we're not hardened warriors like you lot, but... Oh, hell yeah! We got some people! I knew it! I fucking knew it! That shit with that, with that guy was gonna be what made everyone change their mind. Well, not everybody. So this one's not a bad Xbox, just very different uh, in my opinion from the ones before and after it. Well, I'm excited to see what's in store for me with Stormblood, but I still am believing that nothing can beat Heaven's Ward. I don't think anything is going to beat Heaven's Ward in my opinion, at least like for me, for my standards, for the things that I like in video games, you know? Oh shit, I don't know what she said. Oh well. Stormblood is a lot of people's favorites. Stormblood, uh, Shadowbringers, I know is a big favorite. And same with Endwalker. Because there's not going to be a Coco in any other expansion. Man, Heaven's War is still one of my favorites. Everything about the era of the game was perfect to me. Everything about it is literally so good. It's so good. The gothic inspired areas, the wintry bullshit, everything was cold, the El- the Elizen, sorry, the dragons, all of that shit just... Mmm. So fucking good. That's my shit. Oh, there's Liz. I forgot I was logged in. Yeah, well, you're right there. <laughs> yeah, Heaven's Ward is my favorite. I mean, I I don't really have much to like compare it to, but I, ugh, so good. And Walker has been pretty good. And Walker patch quests have been good, but I got to them too fast and had to grind for gear. Oh no! Oh no! I want to grind for cool gear. My husband is still sitting here. Hello, husband. Hello. Oh. Oh. That's an interesting minion. Oh, it's kind of creepy. Hello. All right, let's turn this in. There's the politics of dragons and dungeons. I know exactly the politics. Sign me the fuck up. It was very Game of Thrones. <laughs> You know? First of all, allow me to commend you both on the job well done. But nothing went according to plan. <laughs> we nevertheless managed to attract some new recruits, and it was your passion and conviction that moved them to join. Thank you. No, thank you for giving me an opportunity to find out what our people have been through these past 20 years. It's been humbling. And troubling, too. I heard about the skulls, but that was the first time I'd seen them in the flesh. I know you say they're the same as any other Imperial soldiers, and maybe that's how I'll have to think of them myself if our paths ever cross on the battlefield, but... When, not if, that day will come, Lise. You can't afford to hesitate when it does. Young, old, conscript, citizen, Garlean, Alamegan, none of that matters. They've all got their reasons, but they're no better than yours, especially when they're bearing down on you, blade in hand. Saying that, I don't want to kill them any more than you do. If I could convince them to lay down their arms, I would. Sadly, I'd never been much of a talker myself, but who knows? Maybe you could be one least. Your father certainly was. Right then, I'd best begin preparing for these new recruits. Pepper, Lise, it's been a pleasure. Nice. Um. I will get this. Alright, on to quest number two. Hello, husband. Goodbye, husband. Love you, babe. My bad. Press the wrong button again. <laughs> Working on Stormblood? Yes. Very, very, very slowly hacking away at Stormblood. 
very, very slowly. Uh, I only just started it today, and I am nervous to find out how long it's gonna be. So far, nothing compelling is happening, but I only did just start it, so I, you know, beggars can't be choosers. Go boss. First time I played this game, I blasted the main story quest because it was so good. Yeah, that basically happened to me too. I just beam through it. Cool, I can do more sightseeing now. Alright, what up, Nago? I don't even remember what their quest was. In the fringes. Okay. Guess we're about to find out. Okay, no, let me just read it here. If I if I can, if I can, that'd be great. <laughs> Having put your fares in order, you leave Ralgar's reach with Nago and Alize. If the gods are good, your journey through the furnace should be quick and uneventful. I, that still doesn't answer my question. Ooh, I do like it though. It's spooky and foggy and sandy. Ooh. Oh, I'm kind of vibing. Oh, the music is so nice. Let's go. Oh, we're almost there. Down here? Is it up here? Hey, okay, quite so. Ooh, there's an ether current over there. Perfect. We'll grab that. Um, what is that fucking bird? It's like an eagle, dragon, turkey lizard. What the fuck? Damn, your journal is stacked. Yeah, it is literally just full of job quests. I want to burn through them so bad. Let's see. So we have Rogue, we have Scholar, Dancer, uh, Gunbreaker, is this Ninja? Samurai, a Red Mage, Reaper, I believe, Astro, uh, Machinist or Machinist. I think this is a relic quest. And yeah. Have to get that shit done. See, usually same, but because I'm a streamer, half the time I'm like, oh my god, I could just do this on stream. And then I don't do it on stream. <laughs> That's what I was asking chat earlier. It's like, would you all like to see me do these on stream? Oh shit, wait. When you grow up hunting in these lands, you learn to discern the sounds that can mean life and death, and be they a, of a predator or a patrol. From what I'm hearing, we have a seven map patrol augmented with a single Magitech armor. Ooh. Wide search pattern. Divide into two. No three teams. I don't think they know we're here. It's risky, but we should split up and try to take them all by surprise at the same time. We don't want them calling reinforcements. Okay. Three teams, three of us. Nothing for it, then. Where are they? Head north. You should see them long before they see you. I'll deal with the ones to the south. The armor should be just to the west. Pepper is best equipped to deal with that. We attack in five. That should be enough time to get into position. Rendezvous on the west bank after. Any questions? No? Then good luck. Damn. Okay, chill. Swear to God. If this bird... That was me! Things. They had the ruby crusted ones in the other area, right? Um, in. Oh, it's not coming to me. But it's in uh, Krithus. I 
you for the hydration. Nice. I did it, babe. So I did it. I'm a professional. So they want to meet up here on the west bank, I think they said. Oh, it's a good thing I can get up here. Don't aggro me, don't aggro me. Thank you. As everyone say, hey Gandalf, my day was alright. My day was fine. It was full of me running errands, being very tired. The usual. Alright, let's see. Are any of these good for me? No! Nor! What do they look like at least? Oh, it's this armor! I do kind of like it though. I do kind of like it. I remember looking at it in the market and thinking, hmm, would I use it? Probably not. I need to find like a nice mint color for peppermint. For, well, obvious reasons, because mint. I guess like the Celeste green. Yeah, it'd have to be that. Oh, no, this one. This one is actually just mint. Mm, none of these look good. None of them. Not a single one. Ooh, I guess this, like, red looks kind of sick. Um, they all sell decently on the market, so I'll just grab one. Oh, baby! Level 70 Dark Knight! Are you afraid of the dark? Babes. Just a little bit. I still sleep with a nightlight. <laughs> All right, question. Do we continue with the MSQ or do we take a break and do the Dark Knight quest? What are the vibes? I have to do errands after work tomorrow? Godspeed. Hope it doesn't uh, burn you out. Every time I do my errands, I get fucking pooped. Running errands is literally a chore for me. I have, well, I had a night light. Now I just have like ambient, ambient, ambient lighting. It's like three spoons, literally. I say do a Twitch poll. I could do a Twitch poll. I could, but that means I have to actually make a poll. And I don't want to actually make a poll. <laughs> Cage match. Here, I'll make one right now. Oh, someone already did it. Sexy. Do you think I could have some ice cream or would it kill me? I'm gonna have some ice cream. I'm gonna get a fudge sickle. From my experience today, don't. Why? What happened? Worst ways to die? <laughs> I want a fudge sickle. I want my fudge. Line is in the lead. Boromir got boom boom butt from his ice cream. No, not boom boom butt. I hate that. I hate that term. You got boom boom butt? <laughs> S'mores shake last night and two espresso this morning? Caleb, 
How could you do that to yourself? Hey, Skarmo, how are you? What's up? Oh my god, on Twitch, I am finally getting um, recommended Final Fantasy XIV streamers. Do you know how long it was just Overwatch streamers on my final or on my uh, homepage? I hated every second of it. I want to meet more people like me. I want to meet more people like me. I want to meet more people like me. Like me. Do you know how hard it was for me to find your stream? No, I don't know how hard it was. Double hydration, Ricky. Thank you for the hydration. I have run out of water. I'm gonna need more water. I was in someone else's stream and yours raided them, so I poked in and stayed. Oh. Wait, but I love that. I love that for us. That's really sweet. You didn't even mean to be here. I love that. It was all accidental. <laughs> How did everyone in chat find me? What's our origin story? Honestly, this was the first recommended 14 stream that I that popped up. Awesome. I love this. Wow, MSQ won by one point. Wow, rude. I got real fucking excited. Okay, fine. No Dark Knight. Fuck you, whoever voted for that. I met you in toaster chat. Yes, you did, Dissatisfied. You did. Toasty. Jasmine cosplay? You mean like from forever ago? <laughs> Holy shit, like five screen names ago. I, yeah, Dissatisfied, I've known you forever oh my god i met you through spryzen do you remember him oh my god <laughs> that's how i met toaster i met toaster through spryzen you came into my recommended on switch in 2018 the rest is history hell yeah twitter through costly picks cosplays and picks awesome yeah missing me in demand i played dragon's long story short that's true i messaged you and i was like hey um Commission, but also play this fucking game. <laughs> I was watching someone play Animal Crossing New Horizons. They raided you, and I stuck around and it led me to meeting my partner through Drew. Oh, wait, Liz, I love that. It's the circle of life. I was aggressively ignoring my Twitter recommendation because I didn't have time for animal streams, and Twitter showed me one of your tweets and said, then main story quest finds me. Hell yeah. I love this. I love hearing origin stories. They make me happy and they make me feel like more connected. It's like, wow. I count as two votes because of my ego. So <laughs> Dark Knight Quest wins. Listen. I vote Dark Knight. Oh, okay. So it's technically tied. Caleb, I have literally known you forever. Yeah. Oh my God. Tumblr. CJ, that checks out. Okay, well, unfortunately, chat, my fudge sickle has already melted, so I need to chow down. Hold on. Oh, we don't have follow follow age enabled. I watched you playing Horizon Zero Dawn. Vosk, you mean when I first started streaming? No shot. What? What? I was just a baby. And now I'm a shit poster. Ooh, that hurt my gums. Oh my god, Vosk. I'm gonna cry. You've been here forever. Have you just been like a little lurky lurk supporty sport? Oh my god. 
Yeah, you've been following me since February 28th, 2018. Oh my god! I am in absolute shock right now. What the fuck? I'm honored. I'm absolutely honored. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna put this in the freezer and we'll can we'll carry on. I also have to wash my hands now because they're sticky. Oh Oh That was embarrassing. I'll be right back, chat. Let me go wash my hands and do my thing. I really want to do the Dark Knight quest. I'm so mad at you all. How dare you? I returned with chips and I refilled my water. I'm glad you picked up Final Fantasy. I abs I've absolutely loved watching this. I'm glad! That makes me really happy, boss. You have been a delight to like stumble upon in game. Every fucking place that I go, I just can rely on you doing some bullshit in the background. <gasps> I guess they're following you two years ago. Oh, Kelsey, oh my god, it's been two years. You follow me on the bird app? Oh, hell yeah. One of the first games you played I saw was Link's Awakening, which I have never finished, by the way. Yes, Arcady has been here since the dawn of time, correct. This VRB screen is everything? Oh my god, wait, Ricky, look. This is the starting screen, me and the absolute love of my life being absolutely adorable because nothing bad could ever happen to him, right? Yeah, we're cute forevermore, uh-huh, amazing. And then the BRB screen, and she's just chilling, enjoying the snow. And oh my god, Gagunga, yes. And then this is the ending screen. We love sadness. Hold on, let me just like get rid of that real quick. Let me just. Yeah, okay, there we go. Yeah, aren't they fucking cute? They're super fucking cute. I love them. I want to make more. Okay. 
So, I'm not a normie potato chip gal, but today I am. Okay? Not that bad. You know, I somehow forgot what potato chips tasted like. I can now see why people get addicted to these. Are potato chips actually potatoes? And if they're potatoes, are they good for you? Probably not. Eat a chip for me? Bet. This is for you. I'll never understand how these clips are made. This game confused me. I can show you real quick, basically, like, how I do it. So, I type in G-Pose. Okay. And then, what I do is, I position the camera how I want it. Okay? And then, if I want lighting, which I don't really need. And then I do an emote, whatever emote it is that I want. We'll just, let's do dote. And let's have her face us as well as she can. Okay, she's not gonna like fully face us, but that's fine. Cute. And then I get rid of everything else, so it's just me and Pepper. And yeah, enable death of field. Let's see. Is it making a difference? I can't tell. Barely. Okay. Um, yeah. That's it. And then what I do is I open OBS and I record it. And I make it into a little video. And then I import the video into OBS. Like once I like um, uh, crop it and add filters and stuff. And I turn it into a screen. Like into its own scene. And yeah, that's it. So she do a little kiss. You're making me want to play and I don't have the time. Ricky, you should absolutely play Final Fantasy XIV with us. Chicken chips? Wait, that sounds actually kind of bomb. Ricky, you may not have the time, but you can make the time. It's true. I go through fucking waves of this game where I will play it non-stop and then I will take a big break and then I dive back in and then I take a break and then I dive back in and I take a break. This game sucks you in and you never see the light of day again. Avery, do you play Final Fantasy XIV? I never work and I'm paying a lot of bills right now. Barely. Okay, true, 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 true. Well, you know what? I'll play in your honor. You can watch me while you work. <laughs> Oh, bro, yeah. Mm hmm. Okay. Alright. Are we ready? I did play it a ton a few years ago, but I just don't have time for it. That makes sense. If you ever get the time for it again, hit me up. I will do dungeons with you. I will take cute pickies with you. <gasps> Melon, thank you for gifting Avery a sub. I appreciate it. Avery, welcome to come in your bedroom. It's in your stay. Welcome. I'll start playing more soon so I can join. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right. Is it Christus Christ or Christus Christ? Or is it Christus Christ? Thank you for so much for the sub. Welcome to the Come to Your Bedroom and your stay. Thank you. All right, Nago would like nothing more than to continue on to Castrum Orients. Oh yes, that's what we're doing. We're going there. 
I believe we rested long enough. I should we should resume our journey before someone notices our missing patrol. Alright. Did I unlock any new abilities when I leveled up? Probably not. I probably have to do the quest for it. Ooh, wait. Wait. When the fuck did I get these? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I did get new abilities. Hold on. Blood Spiller. Delivers an attack with a potency of 500. When the fuck did I get this? Okay. Should I get rid of living dead? I feel like I get yelled at anytime I even like attempt to use living dead. <laughs> And I also just don't understand like how Living Dead works. Okay, interesting. Oh, blood gauge cost. Oh, okay. Quietus, the Legend of Time of Opponency 200 to all nearby enemies. Okay. What can I replace with this? I guess like the limit break. Let's see. Delirium grants three stacks of delirium each stack allowing the execution of quietus or blood spiller without black blood cost restoring MP when landing either weapon skill So I would use delirium and then use blood spiller or quietus I man I'm not gonna know how to use these and I'm not even doing dungeons like these are two like high level abilities that are not going to be beneficial for me in the story right now or the dungeons that I'm doing. So I don't even think I should bother with them. At least not right now. I do want to try them though. Let me just... Let me just... Oh, 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 wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing. Interesting. 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 I'm understanding. Okay, okay, cool. That was kind of neat. Okay, okay. okay. Alright. My Dark Knight knowledge is going up. Love this for me. Click the buttons that make me look badass. True. True. That's what's important. Or run into rocks. That's also pretty important too. What in the fuck is that? There are some weird looking bugs here. I'm not the biggest fan. I will say that right now. Job crystals? What are job crystals? What's a job crystal? Wait, there's a settlement down here. What if I went to that? I don't think there's gonna be like an ether anywhere here, but I wanna check it out at the very least. Things that take you from Arkansas. Oh, those. Oh, yes. You mean the soul crystals? Yes. Yes. The bigger the Dark Knight sword, the less you need to do. True. That's how that works. That's logic right there. If sword big and flashy, you do big boom boom. Correct. Um, something tells me this isn't exactly a settlement. So, I'm gonna go back here. Hmm. So, if I'm remembering correctly, Mist, the child in the Dark Knight quest line, stole half of mine. So I need to get it back. Cause technically I only have half of my stone. Hmm. But chat doesn't want me to deal with it. So that's for another day. But I might be greedy. Greedy? I might be greedy and do it anyways. Cause I'm the boss. We'll wrap up Nago's quest and then we'll do the Dark Knight stuff. We're clear, only Alliance patrols ahead. 
Or maybe we'll do it tomorrow, who knows. He said the forces at Castrum Orients were under the command of Flame General Roban Alden. Did you not? Ooh, Roban! By Rolger, the bull of Alamigo himself. I never dreamed to have a chance to meet the legend. Are we gonna see Roban? Oh my god. Wait, is it Roban or Raubon? I don't remember how to pronounce it. Oh, your ships are deadly. I should not have grabbed ships. My boy, let's talk! Is he with Pippin? He's with Pippin. Let's chat, Roban. What do you have to say? I gotta introduce you to Nago. She's a big fan, apparently. <laughs> I can only hear your voice now. I'm sorry. Maybe this will be voice and then we can hear it. It is good to see you again, my friends. I hope you are here to tell me you have made contact with the resistance. We are, General. Allow me to introduce Monago of Rolga's Reach. At your service, sir. And may I say what an absolute honor it is to stand before the Bull of Alamigo. Okay, so no one is saying it. These are not the blood sands, girl. You and I are but soldiers on a battlefield fighting for the same cause. Don't mind the ASMR. As you say, General. <clears throat> on behalf of Commander Kemp of the Alamegan Resistance, I present to you our formal response. That's a big scroll. Well, not compared to his hand. <laughs> Good. I'm glad we've reached an accord. Though I was not aware you had suffered such losses. Aye. Some of our finest took part in the Griffin's doomed assault, and we've been struggling to find new recruits ever since. The massacres cast a pall over the whole resistance, and many who might once have been open to joining us have since thought better of it. After all of the Griffin's false promises, one can hardly blame them. They have no desire to give their lives for a lost cause. We will not lie to them. This is war, and lives will be lost. Yet what we offer is not the fever dream of a madman, but true hope. The people need proof of this, Father. Let us show it to them. I say we stand shoulder to shoulder with our new allies and engage the Garleans in open warfare. Boy. The Resistance must demonstrate that they can hold their own against Imperial regulars. And with our assistance, I am confident they can do just that. If we can achieve even a token victory, I believe it will serve to rekindle the hope of the Alamegan people and inspire them to rise up once more. Aye. Aye. Once word spread that we'd won a battle against the Galleons, I'd wager we'd have new recruits flocking to us from Malms around. The question is, when and where do we strike? I'm glad you asked. I have a plan. Pippin has a plan? I'm listening. All right, let me just catch up with chat. I saw it going in circles. Hold on, never mind. Our scouts recently informed me of an interesting development at Castel and Villadina. Namely, that rival of a shipment were rumored to have come from the recent development facilities near the capital containing prototype Magitech armor. Really? It is our assessment that this armor is to be field tested here, most likely against the Light's forces. Mayhap before the day is out. Damn it all, more Magitech weapons? This is the last thing we need. Ooh, I'm burping! Our, your concern is not unwarranted, but we needn't despair just yet. The shipment is thought to have contained a single heavy unit and one or two support units. With a well laid ambush, we are confident we can destroy them all, hindering the development and delaying future deployment. And should we carry this out as a joint endeavor with the resistance, they will have their rallying cry. 
I don't remember. Does he have an accent? No, he just kind of speaks like this. I don't even remember if Nago has an accent. Whatever. It would mean dropping all pretense about the Alliance and not wanting to go to war with the Empire. But you'd have a lot more folk willing to stand up and fight if they knew we, they weren't alone. And you were going to have to do it eventually anyway. Exactly. And so what I propose is simple. We harry the patrols to bait them into bringing the prototype weapons to East End, where our resistance allies will take them from behind. We'll take them from behind. Well, sign me up. I am listening. Simple indeed, and well within our capabilities. I see no reason to delay, especially if a field test is imminent. What say you? Assuming the Vice Marshal's intelligence is accurate, I agree with his assessment and is fully support his plan. Oh, sorry that. I shall notify my comrades at once. Understood. I shall have one of my men bring you the details of the plan and on. And we, for our part, will be fighting with the Alliance, yes? I somehow doubt you were intending to sit this one out. Let's see, did I get anything good? Did I get anything good? No, it doesn't seem like it. Um, what do they look like? Oh. Oh. Why are they so drastically different? Oh, one is a jacket and the other is a chest wrap, so that makes sense. Um, they also have the same, so I'll take one. Alright, can somebody here tell the temperature to cool down clearly? Oh, Elise, I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry your home is like super warm. Hi, Pop to Molly, how are you? I wait back even though you can't see me. Damn, I'm fucking dumb. Ben, you're hilarious. I love all of it. Yes, I love the falafel. Listen, I love the falafel, and they are my true identity. But the problem is, they're all schemy little shits. Except for Tataru and Pippin, of course. Pippin is. Pippin is kind of... You know? The smaller you are, the bigger other races are. True. <laughs> I love Pippin. Look at him. Fate has a way of leading one into the most unexpected alliances, does it not? Does it not? Oh my god, there's so many side quests here. Resistance fighter? What, what what rewards are you going to give me? Fucking nothing, babes. Fucking oh fuck. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Hmm. I want to look up at a bunny girl as a lollafell. Oh my god. Same though. Me too. Oh my god. Do y'all remember Lou's uh Viera? Oh my god, she's so hot. And for what? Pippin is the shirt king of kings. Amen, baby. I mean what? Is it okay that I sent for Pippin? Is that alright? Is that mortally okay? He's hot. I'm haunted by Louis booty. She was just strutting in your face. As she should- what? Why am I in this? How did I get into this? What did the- Oh. Okay. Well. I guess I'm doing this now. <laughs> Wait, okay, chat, 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 hold on. The looty! Ben, don't kill me. Hold on. Bunny girls or cat girls? CJ, Ben, somebody, make a poll. Make a poll, make a poll. Make a poll. I want to know. I want to know what chat likes. And don't worry, I'll ask you about the boys after. Or you know what? No, just bunny people or cat people. You know what? Don't put a gender to it. Oh. Hello, Daisy. Hello, Daisy. Goodbye, Daisy. Oh. Daisy is gone. Okay, bye, Daisy. Listen. I 
am a cat girl simp. I love me a cat girl. And I love me a cat boy. But I'm also partial. I don't know. It's actually hard. It's really hard. The auras are really cute too. Um, I kind of, I don't know. I do like cat girls though. I love the idea. Oh my god. Okay. Can I get lewd? Chat, can we get lewd for a second? Can we get spicy? Are we all okay with this? I'm gonna get spicy. Listen. Now, just imagine you are with your cat partner. Oh, this sounds so weird. Your Mikote partner, okay? And they start feeling good in whatever context you want it to be. You know, their tail is like slightly wagging a bit. The ears are kind of like twitching. They're not perked up, but they kind of like go down and like a in like a comfy like. And they purr, and they start fucking purring. Not that the Mikode purr, but let's just pretend that they do for a second. I would lose my mind. Why did the music stop when I stopped talking? That was so dramatic for no reason, but... That sounds like Limsa last Saturday night! Don't fucking kill me. Yeah. The purr would get me. Exactly. Yeah. I like to think that they purr. Like... Like, subconsciously, they purr. And it may not be, like, a, like, deep rumble, but it's like... You know, like, they, like they coo. Yeah, the language actually has an uh, has an uh, sound they only make they can only make because they still have the purring equipment. I love that. So Mikote's do purr. The post nut purr. Don't. Not the post nut purr. Yeah, but the bunnies bounce. If you know what I mean. If you know what I mean. Nah, it's the purring for me. It's the purring for me. I'm not into like pet play, but purring. It's too cute. Wait, I didn't read any of that. <laughs> I didn't read any of that, fuck. I hear someone. Hello. It's a, it's a little lollafell. It's a falafel. Okay, where am I going? All the way over there. Okay. <laughs> Once like that was my character. I'll post pics of her in Discord. Okay. Sounds good. Oh, there is something over here. What's this? What is that? Focus. Okay, I don't know what that is. Oh, I have to do it again? Did I like fail that quest? Sorry, pretty cat lady, I'm going back to Lala. No! I feel like bunny folks will want to bang too much. Yeah, I mean, you know the term, like, uh, what is it? Fuck like a bunny or whatever, you know? Or, like, what is it? What is it? What is the, what is the fucking term? What's the saying? What's the idiom? Mate like rabbits, that's it. Mate like bunnies. Yeah. The stream just got wild. Oh, this is normal. <laughs> it's just been a while since we've gone wild. Breathe like rabbits. Yes, breathe like rabbits. Breathe. That's the word I was looking for. Breathe? Are you looking breedable? The bunny boys do be looking kind of breedable. I'll have to bring my Carol to visit sometime. Perhaps a more pleasant surprise than a Manalane. <laughs> Don't kill me. Isn't it bad that right after Orsathon died, I looked at his elder brother, Arcorel, and was like... So do you want to make me feel better after this tremendous loss? I think we could both like use, you know, some 
alone time together, you know? I know we want to be alone, but what if we were like alone together? Oh boohoo, this is so sad. Aha, uh -huh. oh no, your brother is dead. Cat people are bunny people? A bunny sound? A bunny, a bunny sound. What sound do bunnies make? Do they squeak? Bunnies just go. Are those like squirrels though? Where's Lou? Lou, what sound do bunnies make? Yeah, no, Arturel is charming. He's got like, he's got the same like atmosphere that Emmerich has, but without all the like, I guess, baggage. Oh, brother, I'm stuck in Santa's radish. I'm so sorry. <laughs> brother in law, what are you doing? Yo, this man, I will never forgive Arturel for saying like, for telling me you were like a sister to my brother. Could you be a sister to me? Bitch, what the fuck? If what I had with your brother was like a sibling relationship, then honey, we're keeping it in the family, baby. Incest? I guess. Why not? I'm playing a game where I'm pretending to be a cat girl. May as well fuck the whole family. Your dad looks like Dracula. Vampires are cool. Does he want to watch? Does he want to go next? Take turns. Eiffel Tower. Whatever. I'm not judging. Whatever's going to help us all collectively mourn over Orshifa. You know, this is what he would have wanted. He would have been cheering us on. He'd be rooting for me. You know? Oh, this Things guy! They looked grim for us after Cartano, didn't they? Oh, how they doubted us. Yet here we are, right as rain, with fancy new toys to put through their paces. I fucking hate this guy's face. <laughs> it's like all my name days have come at once. I actually hate this guy's face. Well, 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 if it isn't Garland's little troublemaker. I like that. <laughs> I can't wait to see the look Ooh. on Xenos' face when I bring him your head. I'm gonna that fuck this guy up again. If my secret weapons here don't grind it into mush, attack! Like, why did they make him look like that? Why? Am I just pepper saying would it ever happen to me? Please bang my entire family. He did say that to me. Those were actually were Orshifant's last words to me. With his dying breath, that's what he said. He said, Pepper, please fuck my entire family. Oh, shit. And I said, yes, darling, I will. Oh hey! They have little icons above their above their speech now. I think that's new. Is that new? Get after them, damn you!
after a smile suits a <laughs> better suits a hero. No, no, that's what he said before. <laughs> or, uh, no, no, that's what he, that's what he said, um, after, actually. <laughs> Sorry, hold on. I can't make a joke right now. He told me to fuck his whole family and then some smile better suits a hero. You know, it was poetic. Okay, like this thing is like impossible to kill. Oh, it's fucking getting. So Yo! What is he gonna do? What is Robon about to do? As a raging bull! Huge. Oh, you know what? I should have dragged them into that. That would have been sick. Okay, I don't know what to do with this. I feel like I should let it detonate on the prototype. Like this. Did we win? We did. He who fights us and runs. What the? Who in the hells are you lot? Amigo, let none escape! You're the posture check, I appreciate it. Not detonate. Duty complete, bitch. Hell yeah. Oh, anyways. damn it all! Miracles of Magitek design my ass. I've passed harder stools than these piles of scrap. He looks like he's missing antlers. <laughs> Look at the size of this chip. You'll pay for this. Mark my words, the next time we meet will be the last. Yeah. I actually hope so. Hi, run and tell you, Viceroy. The day belongs to El Amigo! Yeah! 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 
whoever's yell that was, amazing. Wait, chat, what are you talking about? Isn't this Roban X? What does that mean? Servers were so fucked, people couldn't get past talking to Roban. Oh shit. Well done, all of you. A calls operation a resounding success. Mm. Can't say I'm surprised. The Bull of El Amigo had an impressive military record before he went west, as I recall. Credit where it's due, Master Kemp. It was Marshal Tarupin who made this plan, and all of you, resistance and alliance alike, who carried it out to perfection. Aye, that they did. Not a single casualty for which I'm grateful beyond words. I have no doubt our comrades back at the Reach will feel the same. As will ours. <gasps> I dropped a chip, babes. They called it Rob on Extreme. That's very funny. Hi, Urban Prince. What's up? It's been a pleasure, General. Until the next battle. Nago, I leave the signs in your care. Every time I eat, my lipstick comes off. And I look so funky. Bobby Ball. Michelle returns to the cash room, then Pepper. Oh, then. Pepper, Mrs. Levier. Once more, you have my thanks. As Master Kemp said, until the next battle. Fare thee well, babes. Was that it? Interesting. I feel like there had to be more. There's no way, like, it was just that. I believe I actually got better uh, gear though. Interesting. Ah, we're going back to the reach already. Nice. Oh, this was really fucking short. Wait, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Where am I, where am I going? Oh, there we go. <sighs> Expansion over. I won. I won. It's over. It's done. That's it. That was uh, Stormblood. Mm mm. No. Waldo can not have a potato chip. No, not at all. Easy clap. Easy clap indeed. My husband is literally still here. I will take a potato chip and eat it. You want potato chip? I heard these are made of lalafell. Actually, it does kind of look like the Taru. Uh, think about it. <laughs> the beginning of a campaign by United Eorzea to drive the Garlay into my land. Yeah, the Alliance and the Resistance fought together. We'd love to see it. Two worlds, one family. Hmm, they're gonna spread word of it. Nice. This is exactly what my ego needs. Hell yeah. If Walter could have a chip, I'd give him one. These are just regular potato chips. Nothing crazy. Mm. Hmm. Does Stormblood have a lot of um voice acting? Or am I gonna have to do the voice acting? Who are these? He's back, he brought recruits. Several amongst the Scion's ranks that were eager to take part in our joint endeavor with the resistance who I am come to, to present. Increase as I go on? Okay, good. Good. Can 
Commander Kemp, if I may. My name my name is Erinwald, Len Lenten Lentinus, a half-breed, as you can doubtless tell. I'm here to fight for a free Alamigo, for an Alamigo where women like my mother are never made to suffer. I pray you grant me this honor. You're a true born son of Girabania, same as me. It's not my honor to grant, but yours to freely take. Welcome, brother. With our swelling ranks and the aid of the Orzean Alliance and the signs of the Seventh Dawn, I believe we will soon be in a position to seize the initiative. Hey, Phineas, how are you? I am alive, yes! You thought I died? What happened? He's my homie? How come I don't remember him? I mean, in fairness, ask me anything about a realm or born. I couldn't give you a single answer. Even if I tried. <laughs> okay, new quest. Are you just celebrating? Please be voice acted. Meanwhile, in the royal palace of Alamigo. Ooh. Meanwhile. Da -da 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 -da! <laughs> what in the Russian bullshit is going on here? Who's this? Oh, this person was on the throne, right? It's giving Kylo Ren. Oh, CJ wants to peg this guy? Interesting. I will keep that in mind. <laughs> this is kind of hilarious. Oh yes, this is what we saw. Yes, and they have like the lion statues and like the griffiny eagle statues, right? Alliance forces have occupied Castrum Orients and taken up positions along the length of the wall. Our patrols have engaged their reconnaissance parties on site, but there have been no significant exchanges Oh. Save one. A unit tasked with field testing prototype Magitek weapons was attacked. The weapons were destroyed with the unit sustaining near total casualties. Near total? Go on. His voice, though? My lord, there was but a single I survivor from the listening. unit in question, which falls under my command. According to his report, they were ambushed by, by a cover? contingent of Aorzean Alliance regulars, abetted by resistance insurgents. Hmm. A simple ambush and only Never one mind. survivor. Never mind. 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 Here's coming back in the front. The stubbornness to survive is not without worth. He sounds like Joffrey. If Joffrey live. was given the chance to age However, and become an, no a grown man. He shall be relegated at once, my lord. As you say, the Twelfth is no place for cowards who count their lives more precious than the cause. Indeed, indeed. We have no need of cowards. His armor is so bulky. Oh, shit. They're giving they them realness. Fuck. M my lord. Uh... Ah! 
cowards. They are literally built like who the Who defer critical weapon. missions to their subordinates who hide within their castra, never meeting their prey in battle. Their hair looks like uncooked spaghetti. Eyes. <laughs> I, like... Why? The hair down here when looks confronted like with spaghetti. a heretofore unknown icon, did we surrender the wall to the this alliance? This is now Spaghetti Man. Because my honored father this in his infinite wisdom they, has them. not seen fit to grant us spaghetti leave them. to march on their lands. Accordingly, we have extended an invitation to our neighbors. Oh. Gear Abania is where we shall host them. The field upon which we shall enjoy the sport of kings. Oh, fuck. Patience is paramount. Cornered animals may have spirit, but they are ultimately predictable and very poor sport. But if one dangles the promise of freedom before them while nipping at their heels to stoke their passion, then things become interesting. Uh, don't talk with my people, what the hell? It is a delicate dance, one which asks much of my hounds. And so I put the question to you, my fellow huntsmen. How shall we deal with these savages? Not the white man calling all of us savages. Nah, take it back. Roll it back. Uh-uh, nope. Nope! Oh! <gasps> My lord, I have a proposal. Why don't you got armor like the rest Silence, of them? Silence, Alamegan. You do forget yourself. Ah. Only by the grace of Lord Van Balesar were you afforded a place here, and that in name alone. We have no need of your proposals, savage. Ooh, I will rip that fancy helmet off your head. This savage yearns to hunt her own. The floor is yours, Commander. Xenos got titties. I know it's just armor, but Thank you. you know that meme of the My girl Lord. staring at the dude's like big fucking chest? That's me right now. Oh, some titties, just big fucking boombas in my face. Well, I guess in her face. What, Bosk? What are you- what's going on here? What are you babes up to? Is Voss troubling you babes? Do I gotta do something? Do I- do I gotta do something? Voss? Voss, step away. Take a step back. Thank you. Alright, let's collect my goods. <laughs> I am winded from things? Okay, Voss. be grateful for any and all you can help. Oh, I'm helping them with something now. Very cool. Oh, yeah, I can't even. I'm wearing my Minfina earrings, right? So I'll get the materia. Oh, no, I could have just sold it. Whatever. <laughs> Gotta love, why don't you have armor on? <laughs> Man's got enough cake for the rest of my birthdays. Oh, I did not see his booty. I was not paying attention. But the other Imperial Army peoples, they were caked up. I could say that much. Beeves has seen me before. Oh. I beg your pardon? The woman who best guy is Van Belsa? <laughs> Wished to offer me her assistance. I say this is highly irregular, though I have, have heard it said you had a penchant for aiding the common man. In which case, for the occupation, I was a humble historian. My duties leave me scarce of time for aught else. I think it's important that these momentous events be recorded for the benefit of our future generations. Primary sources are indispensable, and I had a mind to question a number of my fellow freedom fighters. Ask them for them, ask them the motivations for taking up this cause and so forth. You may take down those statements in this log. And Pepper, thank you for your service now and ever after. I'm fucking sorry. I can do it. It's fine. It's fine. 
I don't mind running around doing chores. I am just the warrior of light after all. It's fine. It's okay. My party can go sit back, relax while I do all the dirty work. I understand. Their bones are so wary. Just like Lise when she sat there and did nothing. Just stared at the enemies while I beat them to shreds. Yep. Yep. Uh-huh. Yep, and then she took credit for it. Yep. Good stuff. What? Okay. Couldn't tell if those were ponytails or bunny ears or what. To shreds? To shreds. Do not look at Pepper's white panties. Um, they are black. <laughs> they are black, thank you very much. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, the lotus! Ooh! It's so pretty! Oh, I love this area! This is so nice! Ooh, the little watery droppy droppies. Where do they drop? I sneer under. Oh, I get wet. This is so pretty! Propmar. Why did I join the resistance? Well, if you must know, it was to avenge a friend the Imperial's butcher before my very eyes back in Alamigo. We owned a stall in the markets and a passing soldier snatched up a piece of the fruit. He spoke out before I could stop him. I wanted to get a form of steel in the gut for his troubles. I found my way here and that was that. Nice. This is a dungeon! I want to do it. Well, I'm assuming I will at some point. You might not have to walk. I am aware of that, Arcady. But I will walk. Save a mount, ride an Orshifant? Wait, what? Yeah, ride an Orshifant clone. Listen. Listen. If there was a way that, like, you could pick me up and, like, you became my mount, that would be historical. Final Fantasy XIV, write this down. Let me ride people who are... Clones of Orshava, please and thank you. I would like to ride a husband. Let me ride this man! <gasps> it's Cindy. Or Daisy? Daisy! It's Daisy. Hello, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a little wave because it helped me earlier. Okay, I go now. Bye, Daisy! Alright. Where do I. Ah. Alright, so where is it gonna take me? Mm, oh, that takes me closer indeed. Uh hoink. Uh hoink. Hoink. Right. New mountain lock, horsey? Yes. Well, horsey, baby. Well, book, bookie. Oh, look! Another quest. Oh. Hello, Liz. Oh. I had a bother everywhere. <sighs> wait, I find you to give you head pass. Oh, 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 wait, I want head pass. Wait, you're gonna give me head pass? Where'd you go? I lost you. I don't know. Oh, head pass. I want head pass. Peace. Peace. Hey, peace. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. I got the head pass. The well, elephant should be able to mount any taller person. You're absolutely right. You are absolutely right. I think you're looking for a different genre of game there. I can make it happen. I just have to write about it in my fanfic. <gasps> my ears. My ears keep flooping. You know what I forgot to do, chat? I forgot to buy uh, hair clips for my um, ears so I can like put them in place. I completely forgot to do that. <gasps> Hello, Vosk. Vosk is just... <laughs> oh, yep, Vosk is just chilling. Yep, having a good conversation with Baronhard. Yep. Melon, thank you for gifting Cord Wainer a sub. Cord, welcome to the coven. I hope you enjoy your badge, your modes, and your stay. The 
Devout recruit. Is this where the dead are? Are these the dead? It looks like it. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. I have a type. It's red flag. <laughs> oh, Biojackal! Hey, what's up? Look, CJ is down bad for anyone that is mean to her. But can you blame her? Bio head pads! Bio, thank you for two months, Risa. I appreciate it. Thank you. Look, all I'm saying is I love head pads. Okay, look. It says so right here. Head pads, please. There's a reason I have my head pad emote somewhere in my emote section now give me head pads are you here to give me head pads are you gonna give me head pads Jin hi Jin oh I remember you thank you for the head pads Jin thank you oh yeah you're Kelsey's friend right are you bio you're bio right yeah sick oh <gasps> I got a kiss I got a kiss too I got a kiss. Oh no. Oh no. I got a kiss. I got a kiss. Someone in Uber just rode past me in the sickle <laughs> on a motorcycle. Who <laughs> rides a motorcycle <laughs> through a hospital? That's Liz. Yo, Liz got places to go, okay? Liz got places to go and people to see. <laughs> I love that, like, we can identify people based off of, like, the uwu thing. What if our FC gets so bad that we just see idiots doing nonsense all over the place? That's what I want. That's what I want. People that none of us have ever met just going about in clan uwu. That's my goal. You have an FC? I do have an FC. If you don't have the free trial and you've actually bought the game, you can join it as long as you are on Crystal Goblin. Just come find me and I will haul it to you. Actually, you know what? Pepperfont, I'm gonna give you perms so people can find you in wherever the fuck you be. That way you can give them, you can accept them and recruit them and whatever because I'm lazy and someone has to carry my torch. Final Fantasy 14, it is doing nonsense all over the place, exactly. That is exactly what this game is. And if you're lucky, you will find me and Pepperfawn either in Foundation or in New Gridania idling together overnight. <laughs> okay, I'm looking for someone here and I cannot find them. Probably under here, right? Yes. Fire recruit, oh, oh, there, ooh, ooh, ee, ee, ooh. Ooh, E. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I found them in Gridania. Yeah, they just be chilling in Gridania. Find them all over the place. It's so weird. I, every, they play hide and seek with me all the time, and it's very funny. Vosk, I also find you all over the place. You are one to talk. Are you serious? More quests? At least these ones are all in the same place, I guess. I made a new character on the server. It's taking me a while to travel. That is fine. Hold on. Where's Pepperfawn? Can I give Pepperfawn perms like this? Hold on. Let me see. Or can I do it... Can I do it here? Promote. Let's see. Invitations. Yes. Yes. That's it, right? Applications. Applications and invitations. Oh, shit.
Yeah. Sick. Sick. Not only are they a knight, they're also an officer now. All in together overnight is that what the kids are calling it these days? <laughs> Absolutely. You know, just a, a friendly, a friendly idol. Herpes, is it? That does not say herpes. Herbs, is it? Six sprigs of whatever's on hand? Afraid I can't spare that much. You'll take two and be glad of it. Uh... Herpes, is it? Yes, Doc. I have herpes. Thank you. <laughs> Lazy husband number one if you wish to join Clan Uwu. Exactly! <laughs> exactly! Exactly! Husband number one. I guess Pepperbond is husband number two, because Spearmint is technically husband number one, but. <laughs> Pepperbond actually goes on adventures with me and lets me die in dungeons because they suck at healing my ass. Take your herpes and enjoy it. <laughs> I'll give you two herpes. Two herps. Okay, I'm looking for a missing recruit and on god. <laughs> I don't see shit, babe. Sorry. Do not mean to blow you off. Are they back here? They get distracted by Pepper's Booty and Grace and Booty? Uh, not Pepper's Booty, Lou's Booty. <laughs> the Looty. Would like to see a fat Moogle? I would love to see a fat Moogle. Would you like to see one too? Where's the other fat Moogle? I don't see it. Where are you, Liz? Liz! Oh, there you are. Two jiggly moogles just jiggling about. Like the portents foretold. <laughs> they literally hiss. I love that. Okay. I'm sensing inspiration for our D&D &D god Iris. Okay. Oh my god, that's what I have to look for? The little sparkles in the ground? Okay, so I'm assuming they're gonna be by trees? This shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, unless my character starts walking around all free wee nilly. Okay. What was the dream I had? What was your dream? That I was riding a fat moogle? Beauty scratch will soul eat your face, absolutely. I do have it, Liz. It's one of my fave mounts. It's really goofy. We'll go with riding you riding the Moogle. Uh Arcady? Are you having foul dreams about peppermint? She is married to two or chiffons, okay? She has husbands! Oh. Moogles are really fucking cute. I love them. Can you see mine behind me? <laughs> I am married cubed. No, wouldn't it be squared? I don't have three husbands yet. Three husbands would be married cubed. Oh, those potato chips are hidden, my fucking. 
my tummy. Oh, you were counting yourself? Oh, I'm sorry. Prematurely. Yes, my bad. How could I have forgotten you? Prematurely. One day you'll be part of the army. That day is coming, right? <laughs> no, not boom boom butt. I just feel sick. <laughs> Two to seven or chiffons. Yep, I need more. Come on, Jet. Where are my boys? Where are my sweet boys? I told you, if you want me to kiss you, if you want a kiss from me, all you gotta do is become Orshabot in game and I will give you kisses. Uh, do you see how many kisses I give Pepperfont? Kayla, boom boom butt is something that you would say. You would absolutely say you have boom boom butt if you had diarrhea. Boom boom butt. Oh no, I've got the boom booms. I'm Orshabot. Tuffy, are you? I don't see you in game as Orshabot. Can't kiss you, can I? If I don't want to be your spawn, but can just be Uber husband or something. Not the same. Actually, yeah, I'll take it. Oh. Oh. Hi. No, I'm Tuffy Tuff on uh, F14. Wait, Tuffy Tuffy? That's actually kind of funny, too. <laughs> I actually kind of like that. What are you giving me? I'll give you one gill. Oh. Um. Did you. Did you not. Did you not want my gill? Did you not want that? Oh, I can't give what I wanted to? Aww. Well, I appreciate you wanting to give me something. I get hug. It's the thought that counts. Oh, I just slapped you. I'm sorry. Um. Hug. Yee. Thank you. It's about the count vibes. A Moogle rug? Cute. Pepper is a master negotiator. Mm hmm. And a master baiter. She's good at baiting everybody. Right? That's how that works. She's a master at baiting and negotiating. <laughs> Part time God, as my witness, I did not say anything. I did not say anything about um, the baiting at a high level, at a high rank. God, you did not hear that. No need to forgive me, God, for I have not sinned. Oh well, yeah, she's a tank baiting people is her job. See? You get me? It's part of the memo! <laughs> I'm actually gonna do MSK instead of gather. Now have fun, Liz! Whereabouts are you? I do need a full party of horsies! Oh my god. I just thought of a really good, a really good, um, meme. I can't do it now. But it'll be good. I have to make a note of it. I need to, okay. I put one on my throne wish list, but it's mostly so I can buy it for myself. Someone remind me, maybe tomorrow, to pick up a new Apple 
um, pencil pen stylus. I was on the balcony with mine. It rolled off my lap and fell off the balcony. I'm on the 30th floor, so it's gone forever. Um, and I want to draw art. So someone please remind me. You put a porn meme on your throne wish list? What? No. 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 Okay, so they're just all happy about the new recruits. My goal, so I am in no way good at this game. I'm brain dead, but, but I really want the mentor badge, like icon thing, the crown, because it's cute. And Pepper deserves it, but it takes a lot to get one. <laughs> so, don't mind me doing dungeons. <laughs> And leveling a summoner to 80 and Dark Knight to 80 and Astro to 80. <laughs> you don't like you're doing bad? Thank you. I do get like a lot of like commendations anytime I do dungeons, so it is like it does make me feel good. People like my tanking, which I like. But it's also probably because I'm a cute cat girl. Who knows? Maybe it's because my name is cute. It's peppermint. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I love the bow. Oh, yeah, probably. Oh, it was really cool. I wish I was streaming it, but I wasn't. I was doing my dailies this morning. Uh, I was doing my dailies and helping uh, Mark, one of our viewers, or one of my friends really, but just he's in chat sometimes, so that's why I just singled him out. But anyways, I was doing my dailies and doing some uh, dungeons with him that he needed to do for his quest. And I got into one and the other tank was also a Dark Knight and we had the exact same getup. <laughs> we had the same sword and everything. It was really fucking cute. At the same time that I said twinsies, they were like, nice sword. <laughs> I loved it. And I commended them, and I assume they commended me. I got two uh, commandments that, that uh, after that dungeon, so or boss or whatever. I'm just gonna do anything other than DPS and dungeons. Afraid I'll mess up. You just gotta tell them. Just tell them, hey, I'm new. That's it. I always tell people, like, even with my Dark Knight, even though I am confident in it, I give them a heads up. It's like, hey, like I'm still getting used to Dark Knight. Um, let me know if I'm if my pulls are too big, etc, etc. Especially with heals, I always tell people I'm new to healing. Um, keep the pulls small for now, you know. I log in and do my dailies before I tap for the night chat. I can decide. Yes, do your dailies. Get at least a couple of them out of the way. Do your dailies. Cute girl confirmed would come. Oh, but calm! Like, commend. Like, commend! Mm. The operation marks a turning point in our conflict with the Garleans. For the first time, the resistance and the alliance shall go on the offensive attempt on the offensive and attempt to capture an Imperial outpost in occupied territory. Girl, don't look at me. Don't look at me. Firstly, I believe it is imperative that we offer them our full support. As was the case with Ishgard, however, this is not a choice to be made lightly, nor less on others' behalves. This is war, and every scion must decide what part he or she would play. I'll fight for Alamigo, for my father, and for Ida. I'm in it to the end. It was made for us ere we, ere we were born. Brother, when the Empire marched on Eorzea, they will stop at nothing to subjugate or slaughter us all. Van Belsar and Val... Van Darnus were but the first to try. Well, I'll be darned. Though your fervor is surprising, I cannot dispute your logic. At the risk of repeating myself, I am, of course, the same mind. The present situation is untenable and further complicated by the existence of Illibird's primal. I believe you have no recourse but to directly and openly intervene. I thought this was a foregone conclusion, given our actions thus far, but if you require renewed a I read better when I'm using a British accent. 
So, don't mind me. But if you require renewed affirmation, then yes, I'm still wholly committed to this cause. For it is ultimately the self same cause I have served since first I pledged to serve Master Louis Soir and the Circle of Knowing, Salvation of Eorzea, by any means. That said, I shall refrain from taking the field on this occasion. There are many here who require further treatment and doubtless more to come after. I came here for Minifilia, and that hasn't changed. However, I'd like to stay with Ishtola for now and tend to the wounded. As for you, Pepper, you are to quote our dear friend Lord Edmont, the woman who slew Lord Edmont, the woman who slew Gaius von Van Belsar and some half dozen primals besides. Your presence may well prove the difference between victory and defeat. Many look to you as a hero and heap great expectations upon your shoulders. But you, like every scion, must decide for yourself. I'll fight the Empire posed too great a threat. We can, but carry on. For those who have lost, for those who yet to save. As long as there's a battle to be fought, I'll be there. To be frank, Alfie is in my fight, but I will do what I must. She go and fight for those we have lost. I would have picked the last one. But the second one made me think of my boy, and I know she's still grieving him, so... No, Pepper would never fake a commendation. We've all been there, though. Might I persuade you to join us, Pepper? Should you wish to give our decision further consideration, Castramorians would seem an apt place to do it. You need not answer right away, I'm sure I can convince Monago to wait a little longer. Going on. What is happening in my phone right now? Alright! Everything's okay. Alright. Oh! Was that the wounded guy that they were that they were patching up? Oh, maybe not. Oh, he looks sunken. Speak with Alfino. Where am I speaking with Alfino? All the way down there. Alright, it's chocobo time. I'm lazy. Ooh, purple chocobo. So Final Fantasy, like, the world of Final Fantasy, I guess. Uh, they or I don't know. Um, has a ton of, like, really interesting races. that are, like, a lot of humanoids and a lot of, like, animal-esque um, races as well. Or species, rather. Which is really interesting. To be accompanying us, full glad am I to hear it. All set? Excellent. Then let us be off. Can they see my wind-up or chiffon? <laughs> like, I am assuming they can't, but... Just heard of. Interesting. There's wolf people? Stop. My wolfkin. What was I going to say to you, chat? Oh, I really want to make some, like, pepper lore. I really want to make some pepper lore. There are some, like, super cute minions where I'm just like, what if when she was, like, traveling around, like, she found, like, a baby Opo Opo and now, like, nurses it and then maybe it, like, gets bigger and, like, fights beside her or something, like, in, like, my head cannon. Or like the like quarrel like leopard thingies. I still don't know how to pronounce that, you know? I think like I think like a little something like that could be like super cute. <laughs> I just don't know what. I haven't like put too much like thought into it, but I think that could be like 
something that's cute. Or maybe like a Moogle even. Like, I don't know. Yo, Boohoo Kid, what's up? No, 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 no. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. I'm not fucking doing this. No, what is this quest? Whatever it is, I'm getting rid of it. It's this one. No, I have to keep it because it gives me an ether current. Fuck. How pure can she be if she spends time with you? <laughs> Pepper? <laughs> Listen, so my thing with Pepper is she is the only OC of mine that is like actually nice. All of my other ones are like snippy, they have baggage, they have this, they have that. But Pepper is just like, I'm here now. What's up? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> you know? Just here to like make sure everybody's okay. Like, yeah, she's the warrior of light. Like she's taking she takes her job seriously, but she really appreciates her downtime. And like the stuff that happens like at the end of like a realm reborn is the part where she's like where she feels like she can't catch a break and I think that's what made me love Orshafon so much because in my head canon it was like yeah like this is it like this is where like this is her breaking point and then this guy comes in and he's like you can stay here you are my friend I care about you my home is your home here's some hot chocolate I hope you feel better I'm here if you need me my pussy was wet! Ah! It was an ocean down there! I was ready! And then he fucking dies? Come on. Sad. 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 Me, ears down. Not having a good time. And yeah, I remember chat gave me that suggestion. And it's like, his death is like what pushes her to go like the Dark Knight route. Because she already has, like, is, like, skilled with, like, magic because she was a summoner. And the Dark Knight, like, channels dark magic and stuff. So it's like, okay, like, this is perfect. She's going on, like, a little, like, venge like a vengeance arc, kind of, you know? What was the, just a botanist hanging around the science riding them with funny grass? Funny grass? You mean hemp? That, uh, that dank hemp? We love to see a vengeance arc. Yes, we do. I'll write about it someday. Would you all want to read that? I know some of you read my Dragon Age fanfic, but if I like actively like uploaded Final Fantasy XIV fanfic based off of like Pepper, would you want to read that? Not him, Henna. Oh okay, yeah, I saw the post on uh, on Twitter. It's the. The henna that they use for uh, weave weaving or whatever, right? We love your smut. <laughs> I've never posted smut, okay? Okay, maybe maybe I'll I'll do some finagling and I'll I'll upload a little bit of pepper fake. I just don't really know where I'd start. Who knows? Maybe I'll literally start at the end of a realm reborn. Like I'll make that like my starting point. It's never too late. Oh, no, no. I didn't say, like, I... I have written smut. I've just never uploaded it. Yet. <sighs> Greetings, General. I come at a -ka -ka -ta -pa. Our recruitment efforts have exceeded expectations. In addition to welcoming many motivated young Alamegans, our ranks have been bolstered by the arrival of a number of experienced veterans, thanks in large part to the efforts of Scions. Right, my accent. As a consequence, we are now able to field half a dozen new units with more being trained as we speak. Good, I got the corn riders eager to strike while the iron's hot. Nod nod. Just so, General, he proposes that we begin preparations for a joint operation to capture Castellum Veladina. Capture Veladina? That will not be easy. It will, however, be necessary if we are ever to push east towards the capital. There's no profit in delay. It is only a matter of time before the Garleans Gal learn of our plans and summon reinforcements. The Alliance hereby accepts Commander Camp's proposal. Tell him to take no chances. Bring every able-bodied Alamegan who can wield a weapon. Pippin, I want Veladina watched. 
Assess its defenses. Every fortress has a weakness and I would know this one's. If there's no objection, General, might the Scions join Marshal Tarupin? By all means, if that is all, let us be about it. All right, is this the part that where we take a break and I do the Dark Knight stuff? This seems like a good pausing point. Oh yeah, I can't even use those, so. This seems like a, like a really good point to, to pause at. What do we think? Sounds good. All right. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. All right, I'm gonna take off my cat ears for this. Am I balding? Oh no, it's just my freakishly weird hair part. Am I balding? No, it's not balding. That's literally just my hair part, okay. All right. I, I genuinely don't know what to expect. I just want to know what the fuck is up with mist. All right. Hi, Bones. Ah! Thank you for the prime and stuff. I appreciate it. I'm coming to bed. Just stay. Thank you. I right, give me one second shot. If somebody's going to tell me I'm balding because of where my heart, my hair parts in the back, maybe we are balding. But you know what? Let's accept that. There's nothing wrong with balding. Isn't it wrong with being bald? There's nothing wrong with that, babes. Embrace it, babes. One second, chat. Amazon insiders say it's one billion Lord of the one billion dollars Lord of the Rings series will determine the company's streaming future. Holy fuck, one billion? <sighs> one billion? Finds all my art. Nice, Caleb. Good job. Miss has been waiting for you for a long time. Oh, I don't like that. As you can see, Sid has yet to fully recover from his bout with Sir Ampongi, with champagne, and there's no telling how much more time he will require. But my quest, my quest, my quest will brook no delay. If we must seek out another soul in need of succor with their assistance, then so be it. Do you agree? Yeah. And we are of one mind. Now then, where shall we begin our search? War is perhaps the greatest source of man's misery. So much death and destruction. A battlefield, perhaps. Uh-huh. Yes, yes. The slaughter you bore witness to at Castrum Oriens is precisely that of which I speak. A tragedy which tore apart the lives of every man and woman it touched. My mind is made up. That is where we must go. Are you fucking telling me I'm going back to where I just was? Ugh, if I had it my way, I'd not let you out of my sight. But again, it's your, sister, it's your soul crystal at stake. I'm only here to help you reclaim your ether. If you think you can look after him by yourself, then by all means. As for me... I think I finally regained enough strength to make the journey back to Ishgard. When you finish in Girabanya, come and find us at the Forgotten Night. Sarnix! Hi! How are you? Alright. Is this it? Let's see. Do they want me speaking to, like, to Lise? About Papa Limo or something? How are you, Sarn? What's up, bud? We're taking a break from the MSQ, which is ironic because now I'm back here. I literally just left. <laughs> uh, but you're taking a break to catch up on the Dark Knight quest line. Castrum Orions, how it buzzes with life. So many brave soldiers resolve to their duty no matter the cost. But have no doubt there will be a cost, and it will be most high, for no man is beyond the reach of fate. Death will not be denied. This place, this place, it weighs on me. Anywhere but here I would search. Oh. All right, uh, where am I rendezvousing with you? Up here? Okay. I'm really excited to see what this Dark Knight quest is all about. Like this, this uh, quest line. 
It is super intriguing. I don't understand Mist, but I have a terrible theory that I brought up on stream. Um, Mist has Isale's hair. I have never seen anybody with Isale's hair. And Mist also bears the colors that Orshifon bears, like the blue eyes, the the bluey hair. Like it's, I don't know. I'm nervous. I don't know what's to come, but I have a really, I have a really bad feeling about it. They had a baby. Don't say that. They did not have a baby. Oh, I got the wrong key. Now it's that part. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh. Ah. The Magitek quest. Ah, it's a good thing I didn't use it. Could have finished it. <laughs> Could have gotten some ether. Ether currents, but whatever. Galleon? Who's, who's this? Who's this poor sod? Come, come to share the fire? I would stand to greet you, stranger, but my legs, my eyes, the whole of me is not what it once was. Pepper, I know that name. And that voice! By Ralgar, you're still alive! Praise him, praise him. Who is this man on the verge of death? Is he your friend? Nay, nay, though I am flattered that you would think so. This woman made medicine for me long, long ago, at the behest of Captain Mefred. Mefred, Mefred, whatever. We were still in Quarry Mill. Oh, okay. If I'd kept it all for myself, I'd have made a full recovery. But I couldn't. I had a dear friend, you see, and so I made a choice. He got better. I didn't. Ended up working for the Griffin, he did. As a right-hand man, even. But like all the rest who went to the wall, he never came back. Pepper looked so cute there, I wish I grabbed a screen cap. That was adorable. The irony of it, that I'd be the one to outlive them all, if only for a little while. And so I sit here and await the reckoning, as I rot from the inside out. The husk of the freedom fighter I aspired to be. No, no! This is not the ending you deserve. I will not allow it! The man he spoke of, the one whose life he chose to save at the cost of his own, that man is proof of his nobility. If he were here... Do you wish to see him again? Your dear friend. Hudart? Hudart? I more than anything, but there's no point in praying for the impossible. He died with the rest. I'm sure of it. He was the Griffin's double. Oh, and one of his top commanders besides. Shit. You're a kind boy, you are, and I'm grateful for the company and his for the company in these twilight hours but there's no need to trouble yourself further my time is nearly spent oh then spent the remainder thinking of better days galleon and not dwelling on the deaths of me and mine god strike me down who dart no no it can't be this is not more than a trick an illusion a lie but even if it is a lie hear me who dart I have a favor to ask of you. One final favor of a dying fool. Oh, this is sad. Return to the Reach, to Bloodstorm. Offer a prayer to our brothers there. I will, Galleon. You have my word. And then he's just gonna pass, right? <laughs> Presumably. We should talk. Outside. What? Okay. All right, gonna speak with Hudar. Hudar, Hudart. Hold the door! All right, let's see what he has to say. Where is he? He's over here. Oh, buy this sprite. Nope, oh, that's missed. My bad. To Mefred and Galleon, you were larger than life. I always wanted to meet you, and here we are. Though I reckon this doesn't really count, does it? If only I could go back and tell myself what a blind, bloody fool I was to place my trust in the griffin. Maybe then Galleon wouldn't be dying alone. 
Listen, he hasn't got much time. I'll lead the way. The wilds between here and the reach aren't too dangerous, but as you can see, I am unarmed. This will not be any good to you in a fight. Nor will I, I fear. We'll have to so we have to we will have to rely solely on you for protection. Wait, what? I've no doubt you can keep us safe. You're the plead and warrior of light, after all. Let us be off. Okay. Follow Hudart. Uh, Hudart's gone. <laughs> Pepper like, Pepper's like, did I miss the no shirts memo? <laughs> Why is everyone topless? Do I need to be topless too? Alright, what if I just... What if I just... Oh, oh, fuck no. You're not eating my bird. No, 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 no. You're not eating me or my bird. Oh, we're already almost there. Easy. Easy navigational skills, vibes. Easy. Just say the word. <laughs> this breastplate is, gonna, is getting a bit sweaty, literally. I'll take it off, babes. Just say less. <laughs> Alright. Oh, fuck. They're big. Sure, just pull another enemy with them, too. Alright, let's see. Strong as ever, eh? Stronger even than you were that day, I reckon. They say that when the Griffin's men realized you were coming to stop them, they grew panicked and unsure. How could they take up arms against a woman hailed as the hero of Eorzea? A hero who had personally intervened in their lives for the better. Some stood their ground and died then and there for it. I imagine while... Oh, I imagine while others looked the other way and tried to find some more Imperials to kill. I probably wasn't foolish enough to try and fight you. I owed you better. Oh. Hudar? Hudar! Speak to me! I'm fine. Just cut dizzy all of a sudden. We have to hurry, do you hear me? We have to make it to the Reach. Ugh. This is gonna get sad, isn't it? I can already tell. I'm not looking forward to it. I know, I know this is gonna be sad. This is gonna be some sad shit. Oh, there they are. Okay, thank God. No more fighting, I think, for now. I made a promise to Galleon. I will not fail you, brother. It cannot be the distance. We haven't traveled far enough yet. A man's memories cannot outlive him. I told you he hasn't, hasn't got much time. And neither do I. Hold on as long as I can, but in the end, it's not up to me. Okay. Alright, we're, I guess, making strides. <laughs> oh shit, my bad. Oh no. Oh no. So... So close. Hudar, you must go on. You must make Galleon whole. Remember Hudar. Don't you think I know that? He he saved my life and I... We all went and died for naught. For naught. All we ever wanted was to go home. Oh come, ye wayward brothers, bereft of hearth and home. Beneath yon burning star there lies a, ha a haven for the bold. Raise up your hands and voices. Let fill your hearts of pride. 
Above the churning waters we stand strong and unified. Oh. Oh god. We... We can still go home. Even now, after everything we have done, we can still go home. The name of the quest is literally, we can never go home. I don't know how to tell you this, buddy, but I don't think we're going home. <laughs> I don't mean to be the bearer of bad news, but I don't think it's happening anytime soon. Yep. I gotta go use Soul Eater on you. He's gone. And there's a fucker chasing me right now. Oh, no, he's gone now. Cool. He fell and would not rise. He began to shake and... And he was so close. He could have made it. He should have made it. How cruel the gods attempt us with this promise of redemption. We we did not fail. They failed us. They failed us. They... We... I... Oh, forgive me. Forgive me. My failure is my own. I had my chance and I squandered it. Reclaim that which was yours. Oh shit, wrong thing. As the ether flows into your soul crystal once more, from the depths of the fading abyss, you hear a whisper. But it's not finished. Not yet. You will come and pray with me. Okay. We're literally so close. It was right here. Man. That is grim. <sighs> yeah, no, that's... That's rough. Pay respect to the fallen at Bloodstorm. Alright. On my way. Yeah, it is grim. I like it. Yeah, me too. I Yeah, I enjoy it. It's just, like, really hard to play through. Because I... You know, like, I have to go the distance. I have to make sure it's getting... It's, it's done, right? Even though, obviously, it's, like, pre-written and whatnot. And... I don't really have a say in what happens. Still, you can feel that weight. No respect. What good are purse to the dead? They have not ears to listen. <laughs> All right, kid, hold on. I really like Miss Outfit. I would love to snag that for myself. Their eyes to see, your hearts to console. Not remains of them say fleeting recollections soon lost the time into the abyss. It comes out, it just comes out naturally. We are left only with pain. A lingering sadness for names and faces consigned to oblivion. How are we to withstand this relentless onslaught which threatens to consume us? Is there no truth but this? That all men must die? What is it, Valor Morghulis? <laughs> is this our world to suffer or to shape? The world is what we make of it. I by my sword, that is my truth. Such is the god's design. The world is what we make of it. Indeed, you are only bound by the god's law by choice. You have such round cheeks, they're so cute. We cannot save everyone, can we? Sometimes it is all we can do to save ourselves. Does any of it matter? What, if aught, have we wrought by our own hands? One last time. I gave you my word, and I mean to keep it. But know this. Every intervention has come at cost. A sacrifice. When I have finished, naught will remain of me. But it does not have to be. For all our faults, for all our faults, for all our failures, we have made a difference. All the lives we have shattered, we can make them come together again. Time and death are true enemies. You need to hold no power over us. I can make a place for you in my world. You need only ask. We should go back to Ishgard. You must miss Sid and Riel. Eh, I don't know if I miss them. But sure. All right, and then I think we have the level 70 quest and I'm level 70, so this is perfect. I think that might conclude Miss Shenanigans, because this was the second last thing that they wanted us to do. 
Emmy Birdie, thanks for the raid. Hello, welcome everybody. My name is Sarah. I'm a Friday streamer. I'm currently playing Final Fantasy XIV, going through it as slowly as possible. We just got to Stormblood, and it is not as stormy or bloody as I anticipated. Yeah. Good night, Caleb. Bye bye. I hope you had a great stream, Emmy. What were you up to? What were you doing? Said. Pepper, I pray your trip to Garabania was productive. Oh, Garabania. I'm sorry to hear that. I mean, I'm glad you reclaimed more of your ether. I but wish the circumstances had been so depressing. For Miss' sake. Oh, for Miss' sake. We shall have to see how he's feeling when he returns. Hmm? No, as far as I'm aware, he has yet to return to Ishgard. He certainly isn't here, as you can see. Oh, gods damn it. Don't tell me he decided to run away. Just when I was beginning to trust the little bastard. No, no. I could still be wrong. He's earned a little trust. A few days worth. No more. Well, no, I'm nervous! You knew from the first time that there was only one way this could end? I'm fucking scared! God damn it, Mist. We're gonna have to track him down and make him return to the- bleh, Make him return the remainder of the ether he stole from you, aren't we? He said that when this was finished, not would remain of him. Bloody vague and ominous, to say the least. We'll just have to press him for answers when we find him. You last saw him at Ralgar's Reach in Agirabanya, yes? We'll start there. Ah, oh, for fuck! I'm going to, and I won't take no for an answer. Sid's gotten better, but he's a long way from fully recovered. Besides, you'll need someone else to help you do the talking. Sid's so good at it. I do love their dynamic. It's very Geralt meets, uh, Ciri. Okay, so after this, I expect to get going. Oh, good. Hey, puppy! You thirsty? Oh, there's somebody here. Think he needs some water or some food, eh? So give me one second, chat. Thirsty? Want your water? Yeah. I almost fell. You know what it is? I think he needs to pee. Hi, mamas. Because he just woke up from a big nap. So I'm going to quickly take him out and then we'll wrap up the uh, Dark Knight quest. Um, yeah. I'll just be like less than 10 minutes. I'm going to take him outside. I'll be quick. Be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Chat, are we all here? Is everybody still here? How are we feeling? You died? It's unfortunate. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Waldo did a little pee pee. He didn't have to poo poo, but that's okay. Got his business out of the way. So he's feeling better. I think that's all he wanted. But I also did like refill his water and everything. And I took a really cute, goofy pic of him in the elevator. Hold on. You wanna see this? Look at that face. He's such a little stinker. All right, let's continue with our final fantasy bullshit. Yeah, my dog is a, he's a big cutie. All right, so we're going to gear a Banya, right? Like we're going all the way fucking back. Yeah, 
Okay, let's see. Is it any of these? Or compromise? Yes, these are all it. Okay. Am I gonna cry? Is this quest gonna make me cry? Chat, I don't wanna cry. I've cried too much. This game has made me cry too much. <laughs> I don't know if I have it in me to continue crying. Okay, so there's one section over here. Let's see. All the way down here, right? Oh, it's up there. Resistance guard. Okay, so we're asking guards if they've seen him, I guess. Looking for a young boy with long blue hair, you say? Reckon I would remember someone like that if they were to come this way. And I don't. Spoke the fellow before me during the changing of the guard as we do, and he made no mention of anyone matching that description either. Okay. Don't like the sound of that. My bad. I have a class on job problem in this game. What do you mean? What if we get gifts and then you cry? Would that help? That absolutely would. It would cushion the blow, if you will. <laughs> you can achieve anything you put your mind to. So you're telling me that I won't cry. Or you're telling me that I have to try not to cry. Hmm? What's that? You're looking for that boy too, are you? I was watching some birds late the other night when I hear someone... I was watching the... Oh, blah, blah, blah. I was watching some birds late the other night when I hear someone... Why do I keep saying... When I hear someone skulking about behind me. Forgive me, forgive me, I hear him saying before he runs off and disappears into the dark. Oh, that sounds like him. Then I realize it's quiet. Too quiet, eh? Sleeping birds make no noise and mine ain't. Oh, sleeping birds make noise and mine ain't. Because they're dead. If that's one of them. What? No wounds or any obvious marks, but there they lay like the life was stuck around them. What? I don't know how or why he did it, but there's no denying that he did. I demand uh, recompense. If you find him, you bring him to me. Um, no, I'm not bringing that boy to you. He's staying with me. Ooh, I have Waldo hair in my mouth from kissing him. <laughs> ah, yes, I remember the long-haired boy. Very curious, with many questions about the nature of Ether. He conversed with one of the Adder Conjurers for a time. I know not what they discussed, but from his expression, I gathered it was important. Let's speak with Sadurgu. Okay, and over there. Hello. You said you came bearing gifts? Oh, I got head pads! Oh. Try not to ch not try not to cry challenge, Final Fantasy Edition Ultimate. Don't kill me. What are these? Oh! Dark Knight stuff? Thank you! I give... Oh. I was gonna give you a hug. Oh, you have mo Oh my god. Oh my god, you have so much! You actually- You actually came through! Oh my god, you're not done! A bed? Magic bed? Sick. And a horn. Sick. What do I do with with a horn and a bed? Is it because I am L horny? What is that? What do I do with that? I give you I give you I can't even type the word hug. I give you hug. <laughs> oh not invite the party. I didn't mean to invite you to my party. I meant to send a friend request. I meant to send a friend request. Don't accept that. I mean the party invite. Thank you so much for the goodies! I appreciate it! Oh, I look like a hot mess. Thank you! What were the other things that you gave me? It was this. And then this. Oh, is this literally just a bed? This is literally just furnishing. Oh, nope. Oh, oh my god. Is it the bed mount? It is the bed mount. Wait. <laughs> Let me see these. What's the albino one? That's the bit. Oh. That is just my dog. Oh my god! Pepper, put that thing away. Pepper, put that thing away. 
Thank you for the gifts. Now my crying will be a little less painful. Thank you. Yo, what is that grip? Why you got that? Why you got a grip like that? Why, why are you holding your hands like that, huh? What's wrong? I forgot the pants. How could you for You forgot the pants on purpose. You just want to see my gal in her undies. Right? I get it. Enjoy the free undie show chat. Sure, you know this, but there's an option for you to show all your inventory slots so you don't have to deal with tabs. Oh, I don't mind that. I didn't know that. But I don't mind it at all. Let me guess, we're gonna have to go in here in this ominous area. Our inspector returns. Tell us, have you learned odd of Miss whereabouts? Yes, I want someone to consult with us. I'm sure we have it. Seen conversing with the conjurer and possibly killing chocobos? Not sure what to make of that. Though we can be sure he stayed here for a time. But perhaps no longer. We learned from moments, but moments ago from Gillow here that a boy matching Miss Scription was seen leaving the Reach. He's for the peaks, and so are we. Yeah, so we're going this way. I don't know what the peaks is. Is he. Oh god. Why am I so scared? Oh, it's so pretty here. Oh. This is where we were earlier, yeah. Oh man. It's like that like overcast day. It's really pretty. <laughs> okay, let's see. It's 4.15, it's like barely even dawn. Oh fuck. Those are not chocobos. No visible injuries, no bleeding. Aye, it is as Riel says. These beasts died for no discernible reasons. Oh, just like the chocobos that man in the reach claims Mist somehow killed. Doesn't add up. Other than his singular magic, Mist was utterly helpless. Useless. Oh wait, unless he was always capable of this? We know the answer already. He stole your ether when we first met. Even if he could do it. Even if he did do it. Why? We'll ask him when we find him. And this time, you'll let me do the talking. Ooh, Daddy said. Search the east. Riel and I will head south. We'll meet in between if we find not. And if we do, either you will come to our aid or we come to yours. Or we to yours. This over has all these was so nice. Do you mean in game or in real life? Because in real life, same. I love overcast weather with a glimmer of sunlight maybe every hour or so. Just like a little trickle of sun that dissipates. I love that. With a nice cool breeze that feels like the first sip of a nice cold glass of water. That's the shit I like. Alright, something's gonna spawn here, right? That I'm gonna have to kill? Maybe? As you survey, the, as you survey your surroundings, you observe not of the or out of the ordinary, but on the edge of hearing, you hear a whisper to the southwest. What do you think is gonna happen? <laughs> this is gonna be some sad fucking shit. Like, there. Well, Mist is young. I'm like assuming Mist is like a child, right? Like, Mist is a young boy. Um, so I'm not ready to watch this young boy die. Um, but I guess they're already dead because they're technically like a ghost kind of thing, right? Aren't they? That's, that's what I'm getting from it. I don't know. I'm just, I'm guessing. I really don't know what to expect with this quest. It's probably the most intriguing job quest I've done in a hot minute. Whoa! Whoa, 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 Oh, bitch, we're fighting. Oh, fuck me. Up. <laughs> Seven hells, I hate being right. Oh! That's Riel's mom, isn't it? On your guard, Miss has shown his true colors. The ether or whatever else he took from those beasts has given him tremendous strength. Contrary to his earlier warnings, Contrary to our sim- I don't even remember how to pronounce that. 
wasn't the end of him. And of all the wonderful people he had to pluck from our memories, he chose Ishra to call you the He knows why we're here, and this is his answer. He summoned the monster that haunts Riel in her dreams and sends her screaming from her bed. Forgive me, Sid, but you gave me no choice. What? Say your name. Your real name. No, I should have went with the other one. Shall I ask you the same? Who holds the reins? Though it matters not. We are complicit, you and I. Can you even remember why you came here? Can you even remember how many you killed? How many lives shattered? How many stories ended? Upon the surface of the crystal are carved the sins of Dark Knight's past, and yours are beyond counting. Beyond fathoming. Without end. Justice is an excuse. Nobility is a lie. Murder is murder! Oh fuck, Pepper, he got you there. And though we are most definitely not without fault, it is this cruel, indifferent world which has made murderers of us all. But we need suffer no longer. I sought to make these broken souls whole, one by one, when in truth the solution was much more simple. A world beyond pain and suffering and anguish and despair. A world beyond death. A world in which we never need bid farewell to our dearest friends. And how many beasts will you need to kill to make this world of yours? How much ether will you consume to see see it through? Bloody self-righteous sophistry? Sophistry? From a mewling whelp. So your brilliant plan is to fill the world with... Um, enough of these worlds! <laughs> Words of the dead, is it? And somehow that's supposed to make everyone happy? Well, you're right about one thing, I'll grant you that. This world is brutal, uncaring, without logic or justice. No justice that which we make for ourselves. And I'll be damned if I give it up so you can force your illusions upon us to assuage... Switch. I know this word. Your guilt. I just have never said it out loud myself. Did you not find comfort in your reunion with your master? Even though you knew it was a lie, did it not help you to unburden your soul? To find a measure of peace in this madness? I am not your enemy. Not then or now. I will not fight you. All I ask is that you leave me to my duty. It's never too late to turn back. You are still a good person. You can still be a good person. Fuck. So this is your answer. May maybe you cannot accept what needs to be done, but I can. Goodbye. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh shit, I I did not mean to fucking do that. I I I butchered all this. I butchered all this immediately. I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up. None of that is what I wanted to do. Oh shit, my bad. Oh, it's okay. Is that it? That was it? No way that was it. Hi Mercy! Hi Soul Slicer! Hi Shrek! Oh, she's breathing. I think I saw her breathing. What is this? Was that Ilbert? Oh my god, what is happening here? What is happening here? What is going on? So many broken by this world, and then by you. So, so many. Woe betide the man who stands opposed to the war the weapon of light, for death will be his reward, death for him and his kin, all that and all that he holds dear. Woe betide the man who stands with the weapon of light, for death will be his reward, death for him and his kin and all that he holds dear. Like sands through the hourglass, everything we fight so desperately to protect slips through our fingers, and what remains what remains is us, only us, and the memory of our sin. To walk this path is to suffer, to sacrifice. Listen to my voice, listen to our heartbeat. A tired of charade, justice demands no less. Justice demands no less, I guess. Pepper is not aggressive, she wouldn't- Oh fuck! 
I was gonna say, she wouldn't say anything like overtly like aggressive. Serve, save, slay. Wait, serve, save, slave, slay. Is that Frey? I've sins a plenty, I, but regrets not so much. What the fuck is happening? And if she would listen to me, the embodiment of good sense and pragmatism, then what hope could you possibly have? Is this Frey? A house divided cannot stand, you know. This childish rebellion ends now. What in the seventh hells is this? Bitch, I don't know! That is Frey! A compromise, I suppose? Our dear friend here refused to let me take the reins, but I wasn't about to stand idly by... I wasn't about to stand idly by while that imbecile tries to do whatever it is he was trying to do. No hard feelings about Wiper, May. Eh? Promise not to stab me in the back. Or promise not to stab you in the back. Yeah, it'll be just like old times. Gas? A dark knight needs a sword. Take mine. I love this. I love this. This is so good. No. No, this is wrong. This is all wrong. I offer you peace, restitution, a chance to make amends. Do not think you are above it. Do not think that our reckoning will be postponed indefinitely. Oh, fuck. Oh, what the fuck? So those are like two of the Warrior of Darkness, and these are two of those fuckers. Oh, okay. <laughs> when it comes, I shall welcome it with open arms. But today will not be that day, and you will not be the judge. Woo! Bitch. Yeah, aren't those like the Heaven's Word people? Why am I getting so, like, overwhelmed? <laughs> this is so intense! This is so good! Literally in, like, a fucking arena. Oi! Oh, are you dead? Oh, they're so easy to kill. But at what cost? Yeah! Oh, do I get to fight Zephyrin again? Or is he already dead? Oh man. Oh man. These are literally all the people that I just killed. Like, just a couple days ago. This is insane. This is... On the throne of bone she waits? Ah! Fucking Zephyrin! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! You killed my man! You took my boy away from me! You took my sweet boy away from me! You did that! You! That was all you! Oh, this bitch! You are not leaving my sight! No, fuck you! Yeah, I can lunge! Fuck you! Uh-uh! Okay, maybe... Maybe I'll do a little loop here though. Oh, can I, can I? Wait, is it not gonna go off? Okay, there we go. Eat my ass. Eat my ass again and again and again and again. I will kill you as many times as I need to. Oh. 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 What? It oh, oh. Stay in the blue, right? Yeah, okay. Because the blue is like my party. Fuck you! I guess I'll take care of the warrior, but I can get to. That was satisfying. That was satisfying. Finish it, Pepper, you soul eater. Oh, on you? Oh, wait. Bell target? I. Yeah. Oh, it's in front of your- oh. Are they dead? Oh my god, they're gone.
Oh no, there's okay. Forgive me, forgive me. I ask, I beg, I pray, but it never comes. Oh, they're crying. Again, they go to join the multitude in the black oblivion, oblivion, oblivion of the abyss. Such is our lot, such is the fate of all who are born, to suffer and to die. Do not seek forgiveness, for it will not ease the burden. It weighs as it should. But what of the lost? Do they not deserve to live again? They do. In our hearts, and our souls, and our memories. Oh no, I'm getting so sad. No one likes having to say goodbye. But it's a part of life! That's what makes the time we share together so precious! You can't obsess over the mistakes of the past or you'll lose sight of the future. Of the people still with us, who need us more than ever. What in the therapy is going on? The greatest strength is born of the flame in the abyss. Listen to my voice, listen to your heartbeat, listen. I forgive you, I forgive you, I forgive you. I literally had a conversation with my therapist just like this. Not even kidding, like having to forgive like your past self and like your younger self. You literally- <laughs> Thank you, that is, that is all I ever wanted. Oh. I can't believe they made me fight Zephyrin again. So, this is it. One last parting. One final farewell. After a fashion. In your darkest hour and the blackest night, think of me, and I will be with you. Always. For where else could I go? Who else could I love but you? What in the poetry is this? I am bottling up my tears. I am trying so hard not to cry. Oh, no, they're coming. Nope. They're coming out. <laughs> that was so good. But let me see what... Um... What Sudorigu has to say and we'll... Um, I'll share my thoughts then. Oh. I'm trying so hard not to cry! <laughs> You'll forgive us for a turn to Ishgard ahead of you. I hope I- oh, I hope. I uh, needed some time to think on everything that happened in Girabanya. I won't pretend to know everything you've been through in your life. A man can never truly understand what's in another's heart. Probably not their own for that matter. Pretty much rambling at this point, but I suppose what I'm trying to say is that I'm grateful for everything you've done for me and Riel. I like you. I respect you, and I'll always be here for you if you need me. We're fellow walkers of the path, after all, and friends, I'd like to think. I've been wondering. Mist appeared at the same time the soul crystal cracked, yes? But which happened first, and why then and there? Damned if I know. Does anyone truly understand how soul crystals work? What matters is that the crystal and pepper have been remade whole, or been made whole. That said, a heart bleeds, a man weeps, a soul burns. Thence comes a darkness to consume, and a few hearts have blood as much as hers. 
Speaking of bleeding, I think your wounds have reopened. If you would sit, I would be much it would be much easier for me to tend to them. You should get some rest too, Pepper. Not all wounds are so obvious. Out of the mouths of babes and sucklings, praise Halone. She's right. She's right though. No need to overdo it by running off to the battle just yet. Or to the next battle just yet. If you must put one foot in front of the other though, why don't you go back to where this whole damn mess began? Maybe you'll have an epiphany. Uh, okay. Like, the broom? Isn't that where I met Frey? No? Why do they want me to go to the last vigil? Okay. Where am I going? Oh, am I going to that little circular area? Oh. My bad! My bad, y'all. No, still just bad. Oh, where we go back to where we met Mist. Oh, okay. Okay. That makes a little bit more sense. <sighs> mm hmm. <sighs> hmm? What troubles you, Mistress Mint? Who the fuck is this? But of course, tis bitterly cold this day. At times like these, one should be warming themselves by the fire. Not a day goes by without your name being spoken, you know. The soldiers and merchants often bring us news of your latest exploits. That said, to hear it from the hero herself would be much preferable. There would be no expectation were you to call on us. The pleasure of your company alone would be more than enough. Rare though, I expect it will be in the days to come. But your destiny was never to remain here, was it? Though part of me wishes that you would. My damn dog. Waldo! It's okay, boobies! There's no one here. It's just Waldo being crazy. Waldo? Waldo! Oh yeah, it's just Waldo being crazy. <laughs> Forgive me, I find myself growing more and more sentimental in my old age, and in working on my memoirs, I've had I've had to reflect on the darker chapters of my life. <laughs> Worshipont lived his to the fullest, and if his story is preserved for generations to come, then I I should be glad of it. You will always have a place here, Pepper, for you are family. Yeah, your your son made it clear that I was just family. Now go. Do not let me keep you from your labors. No, it's okay. The world waits for none, not even you. Oh, I would love nothing more than to go into your home and chat at the fireplace, though. Oh, why would they do that to me? This concludes the Dark Knight quest for Final Fantasy Stormblood. In, in order to undertake the next series of quests, you must first meet the following requirements. You must register a pro Yeah, okay, you gotta complete Shadowbringers. You must complete the role quest to have loved and lost. <sighs> have some hot cocoa too? Leave me alone. The simple in case of dark arts effect has been granted. This occurs when the barrier applied by the action, the dark, the blackest night has absorbed the full amount of damage. Oh, I read about this. <sighs> it creates a barrier around self or target party member that absorbs damage. Oh, sick! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do now. I got a coffer. I'm assuming it's just armor, right? 
Yeah. Abyss armor? Cool. Cool beans. No None of it went on me, though. <laughs> what does it look like, though? What is it? Ooh, that is cool. Oh, it's like Frey's armor, I guess. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks. I don't know what to do now. I'm really sad. I still can't get over my theory that Mist was like meant to look like the co like Orshifa and Isail combined. Like I can't help but like think think that's what Mist was, based off of like Mist hair. I've only seen Isail with that hair, and then the colors too, like the blue eyes and. What not? But I don't really know who Mist was. That's just like my thought process. That's what I gathered from it. Because like Mist kept bringing people, bringing people, someone who like they recently lost. Mist was me? That was me? Mist was me? No, do not tell me I just literally went through the same therapeutic process that I went to today with my therapist in game. My therapist over the last like few days, literally a few weeks, it's been like talking to my inner child and forgiving myself for all the bad things that I've done and then forgiving myself for things that I haven't done that other people did to me. No fucking way I just did that in game too. That's not fair. That's not okay. I don't need therapy. I don't need therapy. I have Final Fantasy 14. It does it for me. I gotta tell my therapist about it. She's gonna laugh at me. I gotta write this down somewhere. <laughs> I gotta write this down so I remember to tell her. Give me one second, chat. I'm not kidding, I'm literally writing this down. Give me a second.
I'm almost done. I just want to know who the fuck wrote this, because that was not okay. That was not okay. I'm almost done. I literally ended my little paragraph with cue my tears. Wasn't kidding, by the way. Literally wrote it up. Literally wrote um, that, like, I finished the quest line and, like, what it was about, what it meant to me, and just, yeah. So, therapist is gonna love us. Also, look how neatly I wrote it. Do you see this? Hold on. Look how. I did- hello? Who needs lines? Not me. Am I getting- am I getting group hugs? I don't know who this white cat is, but thank you. Am I alright? No. No. And she wrote all of Shadowbringers and Endwalker. She's the best friend on the team. In short, whenever you think who wrote this, it was probably her. That's funny. Okay. Uh... I think I need to go to sleep. I think I need to go to sleep now. I didn't think that the Dark Knight questline would get really sad.
wish it was too real. So I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> Thanks y'all for hanging. We'll get back to um, the MSQ uh, probably like tomorrow maybe if I'm like feeling up for it. Um, and if not then maybe we'll just do some job quests. Or maybe I'll do the job quests on my own. I don't know. I need something to tide me over. Um. <laughs> yeah, thanks everyone for hanging out. Yeah, it's it's nappy time for me. I hope everyone had fun hanging with me. I know I had a great time until I didn't have a great time. <laughs> until I didn't have a great time, I was having a great time. Um, so, one foot in front of the other. Amen, amen, amen. Alright, y'all. Um, we're going to go raid golf balls. They are Sarah Key's partner and they are wonderful. They are learning um, an extreme raid with their static. I am not gonna look. I don't want spoilers. Um, but yeah, they're on follower only mode, but that's totally fine. I suggest you giving them a follow. They're wonderful. Um, but yes, I will see you all later. Don't forget to join my Discord server and follow me on social media. That way you can stay up to date with all of my shenanigans. Bye friends. Bye bye. Oh for fuck's sake! I forgot that was my ending screen! <laughs>